The fun of Diablo never ends. Some would say Diablo is eternal. Be sure to like the video. Subscribing is great as well. If you're buying this game or any game on the Xbox Store, that affiliate link in the video description will take you to the Microsoft Store for those digital purchases. Just like buying them regularly on Xbox. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes, cool stuff. It's fun to be a member of the channel. So today we've got the final class. This is the Druid, where you are a very early? Is that the word I would use? You're, you're a very, very large, large individual. You don't get much of a say in the matter in that regard. And, uh... Yeah, you're, you're, you're chunky. So, uh, this should be interesting. We're gonna also try to tackle some different dungeons today as well. In some different spots. And if you're wondering about that cutscene, it's just like, oh, he's gone mad, blah blah blah, you know, it's the cold, all that stuff. I know, Larry. I know. I know. I know, my eyes are open wide too. My guy is bulkier than I would ever make a character if I had any other choice. Fire's looking good. Could you protect us from they want me to go protect them from the darkness. I mean, it's not like I have much of a choice out here. So anyways, I'm very, very excited to see what the druid has to offer. I don't think the druid can top the ridiculous magic of the, uh... You know, the necromancer, but we'll, we'll see what happens. I'm not ready yet. I think the necromancer was probably the most powerful class. Like it's it's a little ridiculous actually how how insanely powerful the, the necromancer is. And from what I understand, the druid is some sort of animal like conjurer. Conjurer of giant animals, so I must wait to... that should be fun. Although I'd rather conjure giant uh Nine skeletons. What is what is my guy holding in his hand? A totem. That's exciting. A totem. But I want the ability to conjure giant animals. The PC version? No. Uh, okay, let's go. I gotta say, unless we start getting some cooler abilities, I'm thinking the druid might be the lamest of the classes, but we'll we'll see what happens. I'm not ready yet. Seems like the barbarian, but with extra steps. Right, let's see what we got here. Conjure a lightning strike? Shapeshift into werebear and slam the ground, dealing 16 damage. That sounds kind of fun. Shapeshift into a werewolf. But why not a were bear? I, I wanna I wanna be a were bear. To crush enemies between two pillars of earth dealing okay, I'm I'm just gonna I'm gonna go for it guys. I'm gonna go for the were bear. Were bear, were bear. It reminds me of uh Oh that's that's cool. Cause I went I went and saw Dungeons and Dragons today, the the movie. I went to a screening of it. I'm not ready. Very good? I actually really liked it. I mean, it's a bit predictable, but uh, it's actually really funny, and uh, it's, it was quite enjoyable. It was the cinematic experience I needed today. Let's let's put it that way. I'm not ready. Yet. And uh, Chris Pine plays a pretty good barn, barn bard, with the flute or flute, with the loot. Wow, I must be out of it today. I'm not Messing up yet. on words like that—that's crazy. Wait, is this the way or are we supposed to go down there? I've done this four times already. I should be whipping through this like it's nothing. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. I love that you become a giant werebear. I must wait a moment. It's pretty funny looking, right? Or he's like a giant werewolf bear thing. Werebear, werebear. But it's no, uh, 
no Necromorph. This already makes me want to go back to being a Necromorph. It was, it was so, so powerful. I, must wait I felt more powerful than you could ever imagine being a Necromorph. I got a better club. Look at me. Clubbing her. Hello there. You've been grinding. What's, what's fortune? Druid does so little damage, he already carries around his own tombstone. That's hilarious. Yeah, this this class, honestly, so far, seems really useless. Like, do I get to summon, like, a creature that comes with me? Like, what is the point of this thing? It's like a slow barbarian that does, like, minimal amounts of damage. I didn't, you know, yesterday I, I didn't say I had a least favorite class, but, uh... The druid is speedrunning that. We'll, we'll see how it goes. It's still early. Well, if you want to make the game more difficult for you, I guess this is the class to play. Where, bear, where, bear. Actually, now that I think of it, in the Dungeons and Dragons movie, I'm not ready. it doesn't really get like a whole lot of at the forefront of character stuff. It's it's really a Chris Pine, Chris Pine Bard story, but man, does it beautifully capture the essence of D and D and stuff like that. I think they got a whole franchise on their hands, guys. The D and D cinematic universe. Here we come. I don't know, we'll, we'll see what happens. Yeah, movies are these days, like Shazam 2. Like, nobody went to see that one. It literally, that movie looks like it's gonna do worse than Morbius, which I don't even know how that's possible, but. X Foul, you're supposed to die already. X Fal, you're putting me behind schedule for my my goals tonight. Definitely doesn't seem like a very good. He's a very chunky character. Sucks I didn't get Resident Evil Four. Well, it sucks that I didn't get a lot of things I wanted in life. I'm not you just gotta yet. deal with it, you know. Rather protect yourself out there. I got some hide pants. Oh, look at me, fashionista. The old ruin then we have a dance, a song and dance, and they drag us out here to eat us, and uh, it doesn't work out. I must wait a moment. I must wait a minute. He's so like slow and useless. I've I've never lost this much health on like the easy part of the game. Like this is a very, very, very easy portion of it, and I keep having to refill my health. We are gonna get smashed doing like the more difficult stuff in this. Yeah, something about heretics, gotta get a key. Opens the gate for us, we go to the chapel, you know, the, the same old thing. Like I said, I've done this four, four goddamn times already. I wish we could claim the Waystone. Yeah, and then we get a vision of Lilith, we, we wake up out here, he's burned the place. Now we got to go find a hermit. You came to How do you live months you. without Diablo now? I guess you just gotta keep rewatching the Diablo streams on replay over and over and over again. It's the only way. But uh, hello there, folks. You collapsed in yeah. Okay, let's go do this. I've got my big club. Hmm. But yeah, I'm I'm actually really it, this is gonna be a real pain in the ass to do this today. Because this this character is not uh 
so far has not been strong, and like this is like easy peasy stuff. Like is he so slow? Why does like his swings are so goddamn slow? And it's not like they do lots of damage or anything. I must wait a moment. You be the sorcerer and go. <laughs> Huh. I'm out of spirit. Spiders, am I right? I'm not ready yet. You gotta be ready. Do I know what day this releases? I don't know. It's uh June or something, isn't it? I think it's June. Yeah, he's got June 6th. Yeah, it's probably that day. I don't know, man. You don't play Diablo, but your stepdad does? Maybe you should give it a whirl. It looks good. A uh, few of the people that usually watch the stream have, have said the last couple nights that they don't, uh... They haven't played Diablo, and I'm like, you guys haven't played Diablo? Like, these, these are, like, iconic, iconic video games. We'll do a probably Diablo 2 stream ahead of, uh... You know, this one coming out again. Because we did, uh, we streamed all of Diablo, if you guys missed that. Diablo 2 when it came out. Kevin and I, it was fun. I but, uh, you, you know, they're, they're classic games. I mean, dungeon crawling at its finest, so. I'm, it's it's supposed to be, it's forecasting to be an absolutely colossal hit. A lot of people are giving it, like, early game of the year vibes and everything. It's very, very well put together. So this guy, he's from Diablo 3 or whatever, and he's like, you know... We're going to a place because he needs to go talk to people. You know how it is. Gotta go to a place to talk to a dude about talking to a dude. Dude, you didn't even live near the city. You're like outside of it. Yeah. You're just gonna sacrifice. It's just, uh... It's part of the job, just working on stuff, playing games. I'm out of spirit. It's just a shame we didn't get uh, the magical yet. Peppa Pig to cover. But, you know, I try my best to cover as, as much as I can, and, uh, I must yeah. Wait a moment. You know, I get what I get. Yeah, this, I, you know, we're, we're not far in, but I'm really not liking this Druid class. And all the other classes so far have been very, very good. The Angel in Art. That's not Linga. Kiyomashad lies just ahead. Now I've got a staff. Lovely. I must wait a moment. Hold. To enter the city, you must We have no time for this. That guy is so fat. <laughs> Take a piece of holy cedar wood from the shrine. And these druids, you know, for someone that's been out on the wasteland not being able to eat, we're, we're gonna pick greed on the wood because he's a fatty, but, um, you know, for, for a guy that's been, like, starving in the plains for days, it's, it's amazing how, like, bulked up he is. Oh, whatever. Diablo is hard. Diablo could be as hard or as easy as you want it to be. Yeah. Feels like the PS1 days? Or what? Resident Evil or Diablo? I don't know what you mean there, but uh, okay, let's go. So, what did you write on that? And he's he's going to go do a horse thing and he has me need to go buy him a, a necklace. A cool necklace. A beautiful little necklace. Sold me this too. Wait, this twig is better than what I have? Why well, don't I have this twig equipped then? Weird. Anything else? Nope, nothing else. I should go grab this waypoint. I am the druid. 
Here's your necklace, bro. Bye, Loreth Nayer. And then he's like, go and go do other stuff. And then it's like, welcome to the beta. Buy the game. I must wait you do moment. buy it. You buy it through that Philly link. Anyways, guys, it's that time of the stream. So be sure to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes, I cool features. It's like a buck to join. Why not become the channel member you want to be? There's channel member gifting, the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts to know when the streams are going on. There's the Xbox Store affiliate link if you're I buying anything on the Xbox here. Store. It's a good way to support the channel. You're probably buying things digitally anyways. There's the Amazon affiliate link and uh, GamerHeadquarters.com. It's my site. I write things when I have time. Well, <laughs> Why won't this door open? What the hell? Okay, now the door opened. I must wait a moment. Huh. This is uh not normally what happens in this area. I'm gonna fast travel back here and hopefully that fixes it. Weird. Resident Evil 1 remake. Didn't they remake it? Not like in the new games, but I'm pretty sure they remade it to port it. I know they remastered it, but. I thought there was technically a quote-unquote remake of uh, the first Resident Evil. But again, not. Like, the the, the other Resident Evils, like, uh, like 2, 3, and uh, now 4, they're, they're basically like reimaginings, I, I guess you would almost say, as opposed to just remakes. But, yeah. The Father's light can be sought through penitence and faith. Walk in the light. She's like, go do this, and I'm like, okay. Now we have to go to the small town of Luster. You you have two days off. Good for you, man. I hope you enjoyed your your gallivanting across the countryside with your friends. And that's what it's all about, drinking with the lads. Drinking with the boys, just like we had the, the Necro Bros. Yesterday was delightful. You know, my gang of skeletons. The Necromancer class just makes this Druid class seem... I'd say the Druid class is the worst class in this game. By, like, a lot. Like, this this is almost just fun well, playing as this character you. class. <laughs> I've played all of them, so I, I, I know. Superior leather that I'll never use. Make it like a wear bear. I wish I really liked the um Oh, what was that called in the the Dungeons and Dragons movie today? The 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 little gal, what was she? Shapeshifter? No, I think they have a different name, like a tiefling or something like that. Her transformation stuff was uh was really fun. It was, it was fun. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Hello there. You went to the family, now you get the time off? That's that's always interesting to me. People are like, oh, thank god the family's away so they get to chill out and stuff. Good, good for you guys when you get some time. Away from others. It's, it's nice. Thanks for choosing to deliver that time. With me in Diablo. Oh my god, look at that helmet! That's fucking awesome! You see that? With the big horns? Oh my god, they look so stupid, but I love it. Oh, that's hilarious. Tell you the truth, I should be upgrading my uh, my wear ability up a bit. I do not have enough spirit. You lose so much health as this character. Like I might actually die fighting some of the bosses. I'm really like I'm calling it now. 
Like this character is getting injured, like fighting like low level things that are meaningless. Like this is this is wild. Like absolutely wild. Hmm. I only have two items, but we're gonna we're gonna sell them. I've got first skin. I'll take it. Just so we don't have to deal with them later. Father keep. And I've got like over 100,000 because it's, you know, it's shared between your classes, so what do you need? I've got all the, the money in the world. So this guy's like, go, go to the mines, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to the mines. Huh? Richard, whose name? What are you talking about? Guys, and your silly hijinks on the chat. Always, always entertaining. Ghouls, am I right? Freaking ghouls. The murmuring mill. Man, we got a ways to go. Even his, like, ability recharge is really slowly. It just kind of made like a really fat, large, slumbering, slumbering, lumbering creature that doesn't do a whole lot. Like if you're large and you, you know, you swing slow and your stuff takes time, it should be really, really damaging, right? Like it should balance out. But this, this character just seems incredibly weak. That's Vigo. He whines. Nayrel's magpie. We have to go find her mother that this guy let bribe in. Cause they're all failures. That's life, you know. Dealing with people that fail. Constantly. Oh, it was pretty cool though. Cause I haven't seen like my movie guy. You know, the guy that handles like the movies. Or handles me at the movies, I guess. Technically he's my handler, I, I guess you would say. Uh, I haven't seen him since Top Gun when I screened that. And it's been, you know, it's basically a year now almost, which is ridiculous. But, uh, yeah, but you got a free popcorn at the event, like a free small popcorn. And I went to go in line, and I was like, you know, I went to this other spot, and I was like, you guys got hot dogs, and they're like, we're out of hot dogs. I was like, are you kidding me? And it's like, hot dogs are six bucks now. Six dollars for, like, ugh, Christ. Anyways, um, can't believe it. And then, you know, I get the free small popcorn and then I go and I wait in line and it's like the people in front of me were ordering for like an army it felt like and then there's these two ladies in front of me and I was like okay they're gonna be pretty quick but like oh my god they, they took forever they ordered like everything on the menu I was like why they, they took so long that one of them actually turned to me and saw that you know I've been waiting so long, and they, they she apologized to me for for the wait. When it, like a customer that was like buying all the food, she she literally apologized to me, and I was like, oh wow, okay. That's when you know you're taking an excessive long time to get your order done is when you apologize to people behind you. But the thing was, like, I finally got up there, and I'm like, okay, I'm so tired, and I just you know want to relax. And I'm like, okay, you guys got Stella, and he's like, we're out, and I was like, fuck me. How are you out of ten dollars, Stella? Like, it's it's so overpriced that it's like, I'm not and, and they're out of it. All I wanted was a, a hot dog for an alcoholic beverage, and not a hot dog. I couldn't get either of them. <laughs> it was very sad. And uh, yeah, it was it was quite a thing. My my thing was though is like there was another line I could have waited in because there's an alcohol line. Like if you want alcohol, you have wait in the alcohol line. I, I know it sounds stupid, but that's how the theaters have it. It's just like, probably has to do with pro serve or something, which is like, you can actually like sell liquor. But yeah, you have to, you have to go in the alcohol express lane, which I did. And that's, you know, I could have went to the second line and it would have taken me two seconds to get my popcorn and be out of there. So I sat there and my mouth was all dry and then someone wouldn't get off their phone the whole time. Who I think was another press person, so it wasn't really in my interest to, like, complain. And then there were kids behind me kicking my seat the whole time, but they were kids of someone else that was, you know, 
I couldn't say anything. And I was just like, oh. But the movie was really fun. I, I actually really enjoyed Dungeons and Dragons. It wasn't like the greatest film ever, but it's it's a fun fun adventure movie. So there you go. There you have it, guys. I'm debating on doing a review. They said I'm supposed to hold my review till launch, but I think that's like my written review, so I could probably do like a video thing or something. I don't know. We'll see how I'm feeling. <sighs> doesn't tell us anything. No one goes mm. in, nothing comes out. That's all. Prava doesn't tell you anything? That's sus, dude. I must wait Do you think Prava is going to be like some kind of plot twist villain at the end of this or something? You get that kind of vibe. I mean, she's in the trailer showing us fighting with, was it, Imaris or whatever the hell's name is? No lift. The so, yeah. I kind of wonder if that's going to be a, like a big plot twist if she's actually like working for Diablo or something and it's going to be like a three-way battle between like Lilith's minions our, you know, dudes and then like the minions of well, Lilith and Diablo minions and, and us. I'm, I'm kind of wondering if that's going to be like a big plot twist in later acts. We'll see. I only have suspicions. I don't have any, you know, hardening facts or anything, but yeah. I feel like that's going to happen. The D and D movie has a lot of merch. Well, of course it does. It all ties into D and D. So even if you know you don't want the movie, you can still, you know, you still like D and D. That stuff will all tie into regular D and D and not just the movie, right? <sighs> but I, hmm, I, I see it either going like a few different ways where it it just does okay, or I see it going the other way where it's actually like super popular and well liked and it actually spawns like a couple sequels, but we'll have to wait and see what happens. I almost feel like it's a bit of a mix, but we'll we'll, we'll see. But I, I think they do a pretty good job with, with it. And they, they name drop like dungeon like Dungeons and Dragons locations like crazy. They're like you know, there's there's never winter and they're like, Oh, we gotta go down to Baldur's Gate and stuff and you know, they do like certain summoning things and yeah. I mean, I'm sure I didn't even get all the references, but they they definitely were like they were reference dropping like crazy. Hmm. I'm not ready yet. But yeah, it was really nice to go watch a movie again. I forgot how magical it is to actually watch, like, a film and just kind of, like, I don't know, just fade out and forget things for, like, a couple hours. It, it really is just lovely. Yeah, aside from other people in the theater, but, uh, you know, so it wasn't, it was, it was pretty cool. I need more spirit. Because if you guys did know, uh, you know, I review, uh, I review films, or I, I did a lot of it, and they just, they don't do screenings after COVID, basically, like, they're rare, but, like, pre-COVID, I would have, like, at least one movie every single week that I would go and do a screening of. Sometimes I'd have, like, weeks where there'd be, like, three movies in a week. It was a lovely time. And I miss it quite a bit. But yeah, it was weird today because it was like 4 o'clock on a Saturday. They're always, the screenings were always Wednesdays at 7 o'clock exactly. Or if it was a kid's movie, it would be on Saturdays at like 10 a.m. But a 4 o'clock on a, it was, it was weird. Because it wasn't a proper screening, I guess. It was like a fan type event, so. Filet, you're a channel member again and you forgot about auto renew? Lay, I don't need to tell you how important auto renew is. It's like Costco when they try to suck you into auto renew. Renewals are the way. Yeah, anyways, I'm, I'm glad you jumped in and grabbed that. Not healthy to eat a game. Oh, that's funny. I must wait. Maybe that's the next step for video games, where you eat them. You can enjoy a gaming experience for several hours. That would be an interesting pill that you could eat and then just like fade off and you're like in a game world for like eight hours and you wake up and you're like, whoa, that was quite a trip. 
Anyways. The tunnel's closed. Yeah. She's gonna be like, that's a statue of Lilith. I'm starting to think her mama is working for this Lilith, eh? Do you guys think she's a bad guy? I've done this four times. I, I, I already know. <laughs> I already know. I'm not ready yet. Let's go. What else is there today? I don't know. I, I arrived actually early and I did like a brief walk around the mall. It's really, uh, it, it's our high-end mall that they do them in. And it's interesting that a lot of stores are kind of like getting moved around based on some stores disappearing, like Nordstrom's leaving, so that's gonna be like a huge amount of like retail space and a couple other stores are being shifted around. It's it's, it's very, very intriguing. I'm not ready yet. No. When do I get to summon creatures? I wanna go back to the necro move. This glass is lame. What's really cool about it's this awesome helmet. Ooh, a ring. It was her mother. She killed and betrayed everyone. I must wait Let's go, guys. The athlete, welcome to the channel. Maybe someday you too can get a cool S level or S name beside you. All right, let's let's see. Lilith's blood petals telling us a story about how she talked to her mother and turned her to her on the other side. Oh yeah, and Vigo left to go and, I don't know, hang his head in shame. You know how knights are in this area, in this realm. They're, they're incompetent and useless at best. Oh, it looks like somebody has joined the squad. I've got a teammate, guys. He's gonna carry me through this so that it doesn't suck so much. Let me go this way. He's a vile one, little creature. A <laughs> vile lunatic. They sure come up with creative names, don't they? Where did Nayrel go? She was here like two seconds ago. Oh, there she is. Just taking her down. But yeah, I'm like losing all this health, like fighting like these really like weak level guys. I'm gonna get just like... Uh, it's gonna get rough, isn't it? Ill tidings. Why is that still a quest marker? Go team. Let's do this, guys. Pursue Lilith in Vineyard with Nayrel. It shall be done. Blood petals. Nayrel is no longer following me. Okay. Your entire party must be present. This is ridiculous. How am I supposed to progress with the party not being present here? There we go. So Anyways, you guys are gonna see firsthand how much cooler the necromorph is compared to the druid. I have leveled. Meaning I am becoming more powerful than you could ever imagine. I'm, not ready yet. I'm a werebear. Play <laughs> like I like to watch. It's calmer, isn't it? It's less traumatizing than uh, being in a situation like uh, Callisto Protocol and stuff. Oh, Callisto. Oh, Callisto, Callisto, Callisto. And Atomic Heart. Oh, Atomic Heart. I'm not ready. I wonder what the next uh, Pain in the Ass game is going to be. Oh, 
And as Slaughter can tell, my character has put on a bit of weight. I call it wear weight, but you know. The guy was only starving walking across the wasteland cold for like, you know, weeks or whatever. Just imagine how much my how overweight my character was before he was starving walking across the open plains. <laughs> not ready ah. Maybe it's that magic druid fat that just doesn't vanish. Or do you think at the uh, the cult or not the cultist the uh, the cannibal area he was partaking in what the cannibals were partaking partaking in to to beef up again? Snag it along. I must wait a moment. I must wait a minute. Sandstalker? More like Deadstalker. What an ogre of a character. Thank you. Oh, this character is just so, like, weak. <laughs> Like, what is the point of being a werebear if it doesn't do any damage? Lilith cares about us in the slightest. We've got to kill Roshka, the gift of the mother. Now we gotta do this blood petal thing. Onwards! This is a cool ass looking place though, eh? My favorite game? Halo 3, dude. Halo 3. John Wick 4, Diablo 4, Resident Evil 4. It's a very quadra... quadra weekend. Yeah, I wonder if I'm gonna... patch out some time to go watch John Wick. I don't know if I'm in a rush to, but... It, it would be fun. I, I mean, I probably should, you know? I should probably turn out so we, you know, keep getting new chapters, but, uh, yeah. Too. I almost got my movie Phil doing uh doing D D today, so yeah. Had to ease back into movie watching. That's actually something that's really suffered from my intense work schedule is uh, the lack of movies I watch these days. Hmm. A vile overseer. A succubus. I'm not ready yet. I'm not ready yet. Yeah, that guy moves freaking like slow as hell. He's like, and he doesn't even do more damage in comparison to like this is the slow throws. It's like you're trying to make this game more difficult on yourself. Sigh. Two, two hours and 40 minutes? Yeah, I don't know where I'm gonna find two hours and 40 minutes tomorrow to do that. I gotta watch Succession tomorrow, that's, that's what I'm excited about. Who will succeed in the final season? It's time for the kids to come out on top. Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to uh, like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes, cool features. There's channel member gifting. There's the Patreon option in the Discord for stream alerts. You know when the streams are going on. There's the Xbox Store affiliate link. If you're buying anything on the Xbox Store, easy way to support the channel. And there's the uh, Amazon affiliate link for anything Amazon. Yep. 
You know how it is. I, I feel like I'm playing the game in slow motion almost. It is actually like quite a crazy comparison going from like, you know, the necromancer where you literally sit there and like your, you know, your skeletons do all the work to like this person that's just like. I might actually treat myself to a Costco hot dog tomorrow, but I'm, I'm, I've been like eating way too many calories this week. You know, like the Flames game plus the Zeller's truck, and like, you know, they've had the Blizzards buy one, get one for like a dollar, so, you know. But then again, I'll probably lose whatever I gain weight wise next week, anyways, so it doesn't matter, but. Ugh. Calories, am I right? I'm not ready yet. No, I'm not ready yet. A dead priest. There she is. Yeah, that's your mother. Just writing in her own blood on the pavement. Mother? I don't want to watch this again. I've watched it four times already. She freaks out and cuts your daughter's arm. Which, you know, it's funny. Your daughter doesn't compare or complain about it ever again. Which is kind of funny. Yeah. A hell spawn. Although it would have been easier to watch the cutscene and let Slaughter kill everything. Yeah, that, that would have been easier. Mother, no. Mama! You won't take what's mine. Ow. I just muted the sound cut out there for a second. Hmm. I must wait a moment. I must wait a moment for my character to eat three Costco hot dogs at once. Ugh. I don't care if she dies. I've already seen her die four times. I don't give a damn. If anything, you'd say going through this so many times, it's almost like I enjoy watching this scene. A pit lord? You know, like, honestly, this would actually be really hard doing this with just the druid by itself. I've seen Freddy and Jason move at faster paces than this druid does. Kill the hell spawn. I thought turning into a were bear was gonna be really cool and powerful. It's not. not Am I die? Nope. Stab her quickly before she regenerates. I'm sorry, Nayral, but like, I also really don't care, so it sucks to suck that your mother died. I don't give a damn. Oh, I didn't discover the waypoint? What? What? That's so unlike me. Oh my god. Oh uh, crap. Uh, so I think Slaughter can like summon me a portal. Let me let me type this up here. Yeah, I forgot to grab the waypoint like a dumbass. Oh my god. Yeah, and I can't just teleport to the beginning of this, can I? Can I? 
Oh, he his portal. I don't. I don't get to use his portal. That was such a cool Diablo two trick we got to use. Okay, well that that sucks already. Um, how do I best go about this? Ugh. So I gotta go all the way over here and walk all the way down. God fucking damn, I'm such an idiot. Ah, uh, you just beat this part. That's cool, man. What what compelled that it was it was Sorensen there that gifted uh, Gotham Knights. He wanted me to take a look at the game. That's that's what that's the gist of what I got from it. He was curious what my thoughts were on it, and he uh, he gifted the Gotham Knights so I could check it out and well, stream it and stuff. So that's yeah. That's that's basically it. From from what I understand, I don't know. You need a proper weapon. If you see him again in the chat, you're, you're welcome to ask him. Anything else? All right, guys, we gotta do some walking. Actually, does this take me back to that place? Teleport to Burrsham? The Black Lake. God damn it! You remember, you see, you could use the portals. You know, use each other's portals to kind of go back and forth in places. That was always insanely helpful. Yep. Right? So, right, there you go. Go, go, go. I'm running so fast. That is gonna take, it's, it's gonna take a second to get over there, guys. This is gonna kill my run time. Uh, yeah. Oh, I was also looking at some games that could be bought. I never heard back from that person. Uh, Resident, or not Resident Evil, uh, Evil Dead. But there was, like, games for $2, $3 each or something. I was like, oh, well, there's a couple here that are kind of interesting. But it's, like, on literally the other end of the city, so I'm just like, nah, it's not even worth the drive for that kind of stuff. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not the, worth that kind of one. Because it was already, like... Who was it? The, the ad thing they had up was like, you know, this is the middle of the city kind of thing. And I was like, oh, that's a bit far. And then it's like the actual pickup was in this other part of the city. And I'm like, that is way too far. Way too far. And I was like, I'm not doing that. Ain't nobody got time for that crap. And I've got, you know, I've got time too, so. Does this lead me over here, that one? I don't think that does, does it? Nah, it doesn't. Now I gotta walk. And I walked. I walked so far away. I'm not ready yet. Actually, if anything, I think some some good walking is, is probably best for my character's long term health. You gotta stay fit, guys. I must wait a moment. And I know, like, body image is a big thing these days, but, you know, fitness is is top, top, top. No, no matter what people tell you, if you want a healthy life, you gotta be fit. And you gotta have fitness motivation. It all fits into self-love and self-care and all that. Okay, we got, we're gonna go get the waypoint before we go see this lady. Yeah. Mr. X came out. What did he come out of? Did he? Did Mr. X come out of the, the closet? And you know, you were the first person he let know. That's that's pretty cool. That's a big honor you got there. I must wait a moment. I can't believe I didn't unlock. That freaking thing when I, I was here. It, was, it makes me feel like such a dumbass. Like, seriously. It was like all on the way. <sighs> Alrighty, let's go do this thing again. I am glad I'm getting a bit of a break from having to redo the game multiple times over, though. That, that would be lovely. I'm only slightly disappointed that my progress doesn't carry over to the full game, though. I'm not to do this all over again. Oh, 
I wood race. Look how useless this druid is. He's like getting killed by wood race. Wood race is so like low tier. His next bats are gonna kill him. There is something strange going on here. The shroud of darkness. Do I like this beta? Yeah, it's been great. I've been thoroughly enjoying uh, the beta. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. I don't like this class uh, at all, but uh, everything else has been really, really good. I mean, I did do a whole review and everything, too, for it. It's always good to check out the reviews and stuff, guys. That's how I make my money. And it's not that much. actually so pretty funny I, I brought my was my grandmother some some fruit in like a bowl thing the other day and she's like oh are, are you sure you want to what is it give me give me this the, the fruit and I was like no it's, it's fine I mean there's lots of it because it's like a big fruit thing and then she's on the phone because you know the grandfather called or whatever and it's like she's like oh yeah you know Jay just brought some uh, brought some scraps over and I was like oh okay yeah Make it, make, make it sound like at first it was like, oh, you know, big, big allotment of food, and then she's just like, oh, this is leftover crap, and I was just like, oh, okay. Went from, uh, you know, how would I be able to sustain myself to the, you know, bringing her over like paltry scraps of her food leftovers? So I was just like, oh my god. Kills me. The wording people use for stuff is, is hilarious. Look, Slaughter's here. That's good, guys. Now we can go and kill this stuff. Uh-huh. Sure it does. I'm just glad Mr. X was able to give you a good time. It's good that you could be supportive of Mr. X in these, you know, in that situation. I don't think we're supposed to go that way. I don't know. I'm just kind of trying to think of where this would be. But maybe this is a dead end. I'm gonna I'm gonna go check down here. I mean, we could jump across, but it it might literally be down this way. Ooh, gloves. No. I must wait a moment. I got the combat shrine, but there's no there's no enemies to combat, so that's a colossal waste of the, the combat shrine. I guess we could have just jumped straight down here. I'm sliding down as a ball, that's that's great. the scaling's like for, uh, for levels for characters in this one. Like, is Slaughter like facing off against 22 stuff, or is he just facing off against like, level like, like 8 stuff? I'm not ready yet. This has gotta be the way. There's lots of enemies here. A rugged stave. Oh, look at that! It's a big, big wooden thing to slap people with. I feel like we're killing the tree dudes from like Lord of the Rings when we do this. You know what I mean? You, you feel like you're killing the cool tree people. Is it the urge or something like that? Makes me wonder if we're the good guys, but I, I don't wonder too much. A medicine staff. Cool, now I've got like... 
magical stick items on those ones. Lovely. You guys are letting uh, Skybot do all the chatter. That's that's fascinating. I'm glad Sky Skybot could get his bits in. Okay, this is also not the way. Man, we are really unlucky with the uh, the druid here on getting through this forest. Are you kidding me right now? Huh. Literally took like every incorrect like pathway. What are the odds? I'm not ready yet. At least it's allowed me to level. You become more powerful than you could ever imagine. But the, you could kind of predict and analyze based on, you know, how many levels you need to actually finish the expansion. Or not the expansion, the uh the beta act one content. You're stuck in an illusion created by the Horadrim. The portal will Yeah, 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 whatever wolf. Relax. Vision of Tristan. I mean, it looks like a lot of harm could happen. Like, what if I fall off this ledge and I go into the lava abyss below? Speak with the bloodied wolf. The bloodied wolf wants to work with us, but he doesn't care either way, so there you go. He's like me. Could care more, could care less. So-so. Ents? Is that what it is? I don't know. Whatever it is. Wouldn't they be innocent? Open the door. Look at the fleshy wall. Okay, hurry up, dog, and start talking. Why are you telling me? Back in the Horadrim's We must search. Must search for Nayrel in the dock and hold. There you are. What are the odds? She's right here. I think I've lost my way. She doesn't know where she's going or what she's doing with her life. Ah, typical mid women or mid twenties woman. <laughs> Strangely relatable. I think we have all these skeletons to do all this work for us. I only wish that Slaughter would pitch in more. Making his skeletons do all the heavy lifting. Tsk tsk. I hope he's paying these skeletons well. The past is different now. The statue is the Since it's a necromancer bringing skeletons back from the dead to do his bidding, are they kind of slaves, if you think about it? Y you know what I'm saying? Like, are they actually, like, skeleton slaves? I must wait a moment. Who's to say? Resident Evil? Why would you play Resident Evil when you have Diablo 4 right here for a limited time? What of the passage over there? Diablo! A moment. The cooking pot. You think it's like a slow cooker? This is... Open the door, lady. I want to take a step back. It would take too long with this character, so I will just stand here. Chess beast shot. Like, look how large this druid is. It's, it's terrifyingly it's large. Like, is there any reason the druid is so large? Is it like some kind of weird... I don't know... Lore thing or something? It's the same seal as... Open it up! She's really taking her time on that. Uh... 
I don't know, the trees attacking me, they don't feel so innocent. Sometimes you gotta burn a forest down. Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Uh, donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks. Cool emotes. Cool stuff like that. There's the gift of gifting channel memberships. There's the Patreon option. The Discord for stream alerts. The Xbox store for any Xbox purchases to support the channel. And there's the, uh, the Amazon affiliate link as well if you're buying anything on Amazon land. I'm not ready yet. Oh, we got a big boss fight coming up, guys. Big boss fight. It's time to take on Tachort. Tachort, I feel like I've killed you like four times already. Let's make it five. I must wait. A moment. Yeah, those skeletons are doing work. Hmm. We almost got her, guys. I'm, not ready I'm gonna wear bear her ass down. Ow. I must wait a moment. What is the short like stuck in her own thing or what? Do we break to short? I must wait a moment. No, to short is alive and well. We got the book, guys. That's what someone who <laughs> doesn't own RE4 would say. Uh, actually, I do own Resident Evil 4. I've owned Resident Evil 4 for a long time. I must wait a moment. Just, you guys can't handle the perfect version of Resident Evil 4. You just, you can't emotionally handle it. That's why I didn't bring it out. I must wait a moment. Let's bring her the book. You had more luck than me. Yeah, Nayrel doesn't do anything. Interesting. It's the book of books, guys. Now we gotta go to the cathedral of, of whatever. I'll be jelly of my Resident Evil 4 copy. I am best Resident Evil 4. Ooh. Time to sell I some crap. Anything else? All right, let's go hand this in. No, oh, sorry. Let's enter the Cathedral of Light and be told to go off to Corval or whatever the hell. AK busy work. Busy, busy, busy work. Am I playing co-op? You bet your ass I am. Ashava. Where, where is Ashava found? I've killed like a lot of people in this across my five days of doing this. You have to remind me who Ashava is though, because I've, I've killed a lot of, a lot of things in this. See that the kitchen is ready for tomorrow's service. Angels above. You've returned. Don't look so surprised, Isosef. Alright, let's go and let's talk to whatever her name is in that whatever place. I'm gonna turn off that 
item upgrading quest because that's annoying as hell. All right, let's let's go do this. Enter the cathedral. I just entered the cathedral of life. Oh my god, this game. All right, let's go bring this quest in, guys. But yes, there is there is co-op going on. We've got our necromancer pal slaughter there. Slaughter in a way, or hardly slaughter, and you tell me. You tell me. He's a rotten killer, apparently. He's got a subtitling, too. Alright, let's make sure we check out that little village on the way there so we have a waypoint. The skill is not ready. I think it's up in the middle here, right? The little town? Or no, is that a dungeon? Isn't the town like right here, or is the town up higher? Hmm. Yeah, I think the town's up higher. We'll, we'll get there. It's the co-op boss that has specific times. I, I'm, I probably didn't kill it then if it's got specific times that it shows up. You know, I've just been, uh, I've just been playing when I can play and streaming when I can stream, so that's about it. Where's Kevin been? I don't know, man. Got better things to do. Maybe he's preparing for that 7%, uh, increase in alcohol cost. I should actually do the math on how much it's going to make all my crap go up. Uh, I, I swear the liberal government just hates us, like, passionately. It hates, like, Canadian citizens. 7% seven, seven alcohol increase. Oh god. What is this? I am a way bear. I am a werewolf bear. Bear werewolf. I quite enjoyed the beta. There is a review video for my thoughts on the beta though. That is honestly the best the best way you can jump into it. I don't think I'll do a part two though. I don't think it's necessary. I'm not ready yet. But uh yeah, I, I enjoyed it thoroughly. I don't like the druid though. Yeah, I don't like the druid at all. Uh, only a bit more to go. Skins of leather and steel. Gently used. I'm not ready yet. Pretty cool looking axe, you know what I'm saying? Too bad you don't swing it, you just swing the you know, you just shoot stuff out of it. As opposed to directly using it to cleave your enemies. A war? A war lord? Oh my... These druids suck, man. Like, any other class in this game wouldn't have died at that area. These, these druids are just useless. Like, what a, what a terrible, terrible class to play as. Alright, let's keep going. I must wait a moment. Across the wind swept lands, in the cold, barren wastes. Open the gates. 7% is a big increase. That's a bit of an understatement. They also increased it uh, a year ago as well, up like 3%. But you know, the, the liberal government loves, oh, they love taxes. Oh my God. Don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. They, they love taxing people. 
They love it. It's their frickin' pastime. Corruption and taxing. <laughs> That's, that, that is the liberal playbook. I mean, I, I love to give all the governments a little bit of crap, but man, do those guys excel at those two things. Absolutely excel at it. But, you know, he he looks, he, he does a lot of virtuing, so people love him for it. You know, other countries have such a great, great viewing of our, our leader and his party, which is just hilarious. First. I guess maybe you could say he's the best of what we have for, like, political people, but, like, it's a very... It's, uh, there, there's not a lot of choice. <laughs> It's, yeah, it's, it, we're, we're, we basically, we're just scraping the bottom of the barrel, but, you know, it, it is what it is. Uh, liberal amounts of taxation. I don't, I don't know about you, man, but I don't, I don't think 7% is a liberal uh, quantity of taxation on fucking alcohol. They will buff the druid? Uh, I, I would hope so. I don't think I'll touch the druid again, though. This, this, I've liked every class in this game for different reasons and really enjoyed playing as all of them. But man, this druid just is the worst out of all of them. Like, I, I don't enjoy playing as a druid, and the druid just sucks. Oh, it's terrible playing as this character. Like, just awful. There's a shrine with... Yeah, yeah, let's go do the pilgrimage. Like, the necromorph, a little overpowered. You know, the other classes, they seem pretty well balanced. But, like, this guy, oh, man, he is, this, this is useless. You might as well just play a fun class and up the difficulty level, really honestly. Yeah. Should I be the one to ask where you've been? Oh, Zarcaster's uh, slamming you down on uh, your attendance there. <laughs> uh, yeah. The council wonders where you've been. <laughs> yeah, people can't watch all the time. They've, they've got lives. I must wait a moment. Hark, creature of darkness. Seven percent. I'm sorry. Just like the, the fact that that's sinking into me is just crazy. Like I'm literally gonna have to do the math on like how much that actually increases the cost of all my alcohol. Like, restaurants across the country, we're like, I don't know if we'll be able to survive because of this. I guess because it's a time of hardship, so people lean on things like alcohol to, like, you know, give them comfort. It's a comfort item. So there's nothing like, you know, hurting people in their one comfort they have left. It's kind of funny. It's not like it's gonna help our healthcare system or anything. A rotten killer. That reminds me, I need to get my taxes done. I've got all the stuff already sitting there, but I have to like input it on the, the software, which has taken forever to uh, get the software, or whatever. I must wait a moment. Uh, oh, slaughter grab the idol. Okay. So I don't have to bring the idol. Like you can have one person in your party do it, while the others just like sit around. That is incredibly helpful. Incredibly helpful. You know what I mean? Like, that's, that's just nice, lazy work. Slay a thousand goatmen completed. Right on. I have killed a thousand goatmen. I've unlocked foul goat player title. That's fine. Can't we pick this up? There we go. Now it's dark for me. Is that an Ontario thing? No, that's that's a federal tax, the alcohol increase. That's a federal 7%, and it takes place on April 1st. Yeah. That, that's, a, that's a federal thing. 
Yo, look it up. <laughs> I must wait a moment. Fleshless abomination touched by hatred. This guy always kills me. God damn it. I wonder if Slaughter can revive me. I've never been revived by somebody in this game. I always just get killed. Oh, it looks like Slaughter's gonna die too. Level level 20, 20 something, and he's getting killed by this this abomination. Uh, what can you do? Ooh, a totem. I must wait a moment. A bit of a walk from this checkpoint. Bit of a walk. We'll get there, guys. We will get there. Wow, the fleshless abomination killed Slaughter. That's hilarious. I told you guys, this is like one of the hardest like enemies because he just like he sneaks up on you and he just like insta kills you basically. He's a tough cookie to crumble. Tough cookie to crumble. It cut your ass down. It make you feel pain. Hmm. I'm not ready yet. Like this fight is still going on. Man, that guy's tough. Oh come on! Again? Man, the druid sucks. Let's see if Slaughter can get the revive on here. I'm a freaking ghost, guys. I'm ghosted. Slaughter's not even gonna revive me? Wow, that hurts my feelings. I must wait a moment. I have to bring the idol of the faithful to the shrine of the pentiment or pentitent. Penitent? I'm not ready yet. Penitent. There we go. I guess Slaughter's gonna do that. The level scaling is broken? Or is it working effectively and giving everybody a good challenge? Again, where do these guys drop down I'm from? Not ready yet. I'm just like the, the logic of where they could be appearing from just escapes me entirely. I must wait a moment. Let's go see what this big holy lord guy has to say to us. The abstract monastery. Hmm. Kneel before him and remember you are small. One... I don't think my guy is very small. I think my guy has eaten very, very well. I'm not ready yet. Hmm. It's bad we don't enter together. That would be entertaining. Look at this chunky boy. He must eat Campbell's chunky soup. This is how you choose to approach me. Eel. Forgive this intrusion. Ah, I don't want to watch this crap again. Let's let's just go. To the bear tribe! To the bear tribe! I'm Go into the yet. bear tribe! Tribe of the bear. They must love it when I do my party trick where I turn into a werebear. They're all like, oh, look at this guy. And I always go, hey, look at that chat and that button. The like button. You should. You should like it. Oh, what? 
subscribing's great donations cool consider becoming a channel member cool perks cool emotes there's channel member gifting the patreon option the discord the xbox store affiliate link for any of your xbox digital purchases and the amazon affiliate link for the amazon purchases corvalar corvalar i must wait a moment Return to Reverend Mother Prava, giving her speech in the ice castle. Blessed are those who bask in the light. Let our faith be our honor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Light, blah, blah, blah. Ah, you've returned. Come, let us speak inside. Of course I've returned. What was I gonna do? Die? I feel like I'm on a freaking. Four cents more on the wine? That's it? It's a seven percent, man. It should be a lot more than that. It's tied to inflation? Oh, that's weird. It's a weird way to know it. All I was told is that the local Costco liquor store, they said stock up. And, you know, if they are telling you that, that's that's not a good sign. Not a good sign at all. I feel like inflation is like kind of a scam almost. I feel like it's just companies saying that so that they can make a little bit more. Actually, a lot more. Yeah, there's, there's something about like companies and stuff that I don't necessarily feel like they're trying to like benefit my life. I don't know what it is, but a lot of them I feel like they're uh, they're just trying to make more. I don't know where I get that feeling from, but it's just a feeling I have. Alright, we're going back to the mines. This is Slaughter's favorite place. He loves working the mines with his skeletons. Let's go, team. Let's do this. Hmm. It always makes sense. More like it makes dollars. You and your puns, though. Not ready yet. And your day-to-day, -day, dude. Your regular pals be like, what's with you and your pun game? About to start Malnock. I'm not ready yet. I don't know what a Malnock is. But it's not on my schedule. I'm not ready. Yet. What is Malnock? Is that like a world boss? She'll explain on the way? God damn it. Did they like clean out all the soldiers that were here, or did these monsters like eat those soldiers? You can't help yourself. <laughs> Ugh. I'm not ready yet. You, you take yourself for a punny guy? Shouldn't we re raise some ethical questions about, like, raising the dead to talk to them? Is 
the Black Lake. Coming from the Black Lake. Do you feel I don't feel anything. Let's hurry. My allies must be here to do that. My party is being gathered. What else could they be doing? Let's zoom in. Oh god, the Skelebros are here, guys. The Necro Bros have arrived. Slaughter and his Necro Bros. She talked to her dead mother. Now we're going to the Necropolis of the Firstborn. The Necropolis of the Firstborn. It's kind of a cool sounding name. I feel a cold wind flowing through my bones. So does it go like under your skin into your bones? I don't think your bones, do your bones have like nerves in them? Does there be like nerves around your bones? Maybe it's more like a, like a bigger speech, like a phrase. Man, this druid class just blows my mind. Fun for the entire family. I must wait a moment. Hmm. I must wait a moment. It started in dreams. I saw shattered images of the end of sanctuary. Oh, <gasps> Slaughter's left a party. Oh, God. Now I'm all on my own, guys. Let's do this. Druid time! I'll have to take out these tumors by myself. I'm not ready yet. Time to tumor destroy. Slaughter's got a... Z? He's got a Z team. I must wait a moment. Don't worry guys, I'll I have this. I will be your druid baby. There ain't a hatred tumor that I'll leave hating. They will all be cleansed. I'm not ready yet. Call me a tumor buster. Da, 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 da. Don't worry, I, I believe in my uh, druid abilities. Cyclone armor has been granted to me. Oh, well, that's nice. I must wait a moment. Love me some cyclone armor, whatever that is. My burden. There were others that couldn't Down you go. Silly ghouls. Your bones are cold? They should eat them up. Get them nice and toasty. I've heard they're best served that way. Strider shoes. Uh... Onwards. I think, yeah, we've only got one more tumor left, guys. One more tumor left. We're gonna have to go out of our way and be inconvenienced to take it down. I'm not ready yet. Hmm. A war axe, right on. I 
I must wait a moment. So I left the gates to heaven. It was grave dust? What the hell is grave dust? Discover what I <laughs> like, the, like the dust off the top of a gravestone or something? Grave dust. I must wait a moment. Is it like an essential crafting item I have for my druid? Grave dust. The tumor of hatred is destroyed. Oh no, there's still one more left. No, never mind, guys. We got one more tumor of hatred. Oh. Then the door will open. All you must understand is once I am victorious in hell, the high. Guy really wants to get back into the high heavens, eh? Be cooler if they tease someone following us from a distance instead of just being like, someone's following us. Like you're just supposed to assume? I'm not ready yet. Hmm. Outsider. The Lilith's lament. Probably will be, knowing how useless this druid character is. I must wait to Seriously, you do like no damage and it takes forever to actually hit this thing. Nice that guy just gives out his light for anybody to use. You just like rent his light by putting yourself in a big danger suit. To his barrier of safety. Hmm. I really miss the Necromor or Necromancer class. I think I might actually die. It's getting pretty close. I must wait. I actually died. Man, these druids fucking suck. Like this is such a shitty class. <laughs> Like it, it honestly is, is just fucking awful. Man. How do you die against this thing? It's like literally there is nothing difficult about this game. Until I played as this druid class. Oh man, it is atrocious. I guess I have to refight the whole fucking battle. Oh my god. Ugh. If we could make like a vote to remove a class from the game, I would say the druid is like an easy candidate.
this slow ass class. We'll get it done, guys, I believe. Beckley gets the housing. Have I tried world tier two? I think with the barbarian I did some of that. I would definitely not try that with this class though. The future is just way too weak. Almost get like one hit there. You think with a large dude you'd take more damage? The Necromancer's OP and the Druid is the opposite exactly. It is night and day. I must wait a moment. To do this fucking stupid thing again with this terrible fucking character. God, this druid fucking sucks. Oh my god, this character is fucking blows. Holy man. The werewolf druid with poisonous attacks? I don't know. This character class sucks. It's actually like not fun to play this game as this character. Holy God fucking damn it, I gotta do this shit again. Oh, it's so mind numbingly boring because I've done it so many goddamn times. Oh my life. It's not even a hard boss, it's like a very easy boss to kill. <sighs> what a piss off these useless glasses. Honestly, they should remove this class from the game. It's so awful. Unless it gets like a major reworking or buff, it is just. It's terrible. I must wait a like, I don't even know what makes this class kind of special. Like, what? You can become a, like, a creature for a second or something? It's, it's terribly dumb. 
I'd rather have my Paladin, to be honest. Like, way rather have the Paladin class. It's basically the same as the Barbarian. It's been a while, be sure to like the stream, subscribing's great, donations cool, consider becoming a channel member, cool perks, cool emotes. There's the patron option, the Discord for stream alerts, it's the Xbox Store affiliate link, the Xbox, or the Amazon affiliate link. Vigo dies, he's a dumbass. You didn't need that armor to prove your worth, friend. But I just bought a better helmet. Ugh. Transforming into a werewolf is the highlight? I went with the bear over the werewolf because I thought it'd be cool. Give me the key to hell. I will not ask again. This guy is pursuit of the key to the heavens. Where is she? She's not here, you dumb druid. I'm not ready yet. Is that him? Is that Rathma? Yeah, he killed his kid, took the key from the sword thing, and blah blah. Or Lilith took the sword from the key thing, or whatever the hell. Hmm. I have to go speak with Nayrel. Where where is Nayrel at? Oh yeah, she's over here. That's at the end of the, the end of the act, isn't it? No love for Vico. Vico is such a dumb character. Such a dumb character. He's just like I did bribery once. People died, and now my life is over. It's like get over it, dude. I've got bars. Skins and steel. Good deal. Father voice. Sal Vigo's poor amulet. It's it's worthless to me. Fodder to throw to the crowd. I'm not ready yet. She's going on an adventure, and then Lorath is like, our adventure is becoming and beginning, and then the game's like, buy the full game. That's the end of Act 1. <sighs> okay, so now I got like another tree of abilities. Do you have anything else cool I can do? Wolves. I can direct wolves? Ravens. Oh, that's that's kind of cool. I think I'd rather go with the wolves, though. Oh, I've got wolves, guys! This class is gonna start being stop being so fucking useless. Wow! All right, we're gonna go down here and we're gonna check out these dungeons because we've done all the dungeons up to the north. So we're gonna try that out there. A third person mode. Mari was it here? It was the first one in the chat today, guys. You gotta remember, Lari like cares at a bare minimum level, guys. You gotta take what you can get from people, you know. 
Gotta take what you can get. Do do Kaivo Shot Gatehouse. It's the place where everyone wants to be. Kaivo Shad. Father's Cross. The Cross of the Father. Open my mind. My mind is his shuttered. Closed minded is the way to be. I'm not ready yet. I can't believe we died so many times to such like a low tier boring boss. Oh god, that's embarrassing. I should have went with the Ravens, I bet they would have been badass. Could have went all vampire survivors on this. A bite berry? Hmm. <laughs> who's, who's that bizarre person? Oh jeez. Playing hard to get? I, I think if there's one thing Lari is, is not playing, it, it's, it's hard to get. I think Larry's just like disinterested. I'm not ready yet. Maybe the real Larry was the disappointing people we met along the way. Werebear. Sorry. Just like after seeing the werebear today in like Dungeons and Dragons, the movie, this werebear seems so lame. <laughs> well, I guess it's like a bear owl or whatever, but like, yeah, this, this, this seems pretty lame and tame compared to that. You guys always ask for Laria. You guys live, live for the Laria. Or so I've heard. So wait, did this town become full of regular people again after we killed the cannibals or what? Father Bless, what do you need? How do we sell things? Alright, like I thought it would be cool to check out some dungeons in this area, because we haven't done any of the dungeons here. We've done all the dungeons up here, and the dungeons over here, but we haven't really done the dungeons down here. So I was like, today, we dine on these dungeons in hell. Yeah. Those werewolves munching away at people. Doing a werewolf thing. public event going on. Let's we'll take a look at that. Rites of Ascension?
But this tree wanted to ascend? I'm not ready yet. That's weird. Well, we can't damage it, we gotta kill the race. My bad. Nah. Hey, race, are we gonna have to kill here? Really, now it's got like six. <sighs> Yelp Peak Wretch Bane? The Skull Crusher? That sounds nasty. And the Skull Crusher is not as good as what I already had, so that's that's great. And look, it's a random dude. Alright, let's go tackle this dungeon. What do we got here? The Lost Archives. It's like you guys literally summoned Lari out of existence. <laughs> there. Huh. Oh, have fun sleeping. Slay the demonic vanguard? Okay. Well, this area is nice and new. I love fresh places to kill things in. They're the most fun. Got some new shoes. Hmm. Sounds nice. People stop by. A view is a view. <laughs> See, that's the problem, guys. We haven't evolved our streaming gimmick. We gotta have different gimmicks to keep fresh for people. Keep them coming back. That's not even better than what I already had. Oh. Hmm. A demonic. What does a demonic vanguard even look like? Like what is, what is that even? Prepared the candles. <laughs> That's funny. Prepare the candles. And do strength summoning circle. That's the demonic vanguard, guys. It's the Sith Lord we've been looking for. Well, that was underwhelming. Not ready yet. Return the mechanical box to the pedestal. 
Oh, so we have to go and like collect a box and then bring it back? Okay. This is a different type of dungeon. Hmm. At least I got a fresh amount of content for you. I can't move. I keep getting frozen. I'm trying to let it go, but they won't let me. I must wait a moment. Now you're dead. Dead. You just finished this dungeon? Without me sarcastic? How could you? And then you guys just don't chant Lari enough. You know, that's that's how it works. It's like a Bloody Mary kind of thing. Or so I've heard. Or so I've heard. Can I have three wolves? Is there like a wolf leveling system? This is a very expansive dungeon. Hmm. Negative 123 armor? Oh, I'm not putting that on. A tainted banshee? Is that how is that different from the other banshees? A tainted banshee. Do they yell harder? I get how that works. A lot of enemies in the halls of knowledge. Yeah, this druid class just sucks so much. I'm trying my best, but man, so this class is detrimental to my experience. If I were a weird box, where would I be? Is this an ability where I can't die or something? I think this, that's what this is. One of those you cannot perish. Which should technically be helpful, I guess. Since you know this class loves dying. I think he's dropped gold with it. Now we're talking money. We went the wrong way. <sighs> but I'm talking different kind of currency, the kind where you like the stream. What? Subscribing's great, donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes, cool features, cool things. It's just better to become a member. There's the channel member gifting. There's the patron option. There's the Discord to get stream alerts to know when the streams are going on. So we have such a hard time getting the stream knowledge out there. There's the uh, Xbox Starfleet link. The Amazon Starfleet link. How long is the open beta? As long as you make it. What class do I like best? The Necromancer is, is so overpowered, it's unreal. Uh, but I, I kind of enjoy all the classes, except this one, I hate this class. I passionately dislike the Druid. So you could, you basically pick any class but this one, and they're, they're all pretty awesome. But yeah, no, that Necromancer class is pretty damn cool. Pretty damn cool, indeed. Yeah.
The Necromancer's Coffin? Okay, well that's unsettling. I resurrected Malice? I mean, who saw that coming? these enemies come from. Well, that's a cool new helmet. Now we go to the next dungeon. at three again. Am I gonna do it or are you gonna do the world boss at three again? Alright, let's go tackle should we go do this one? Defiled catacomb or the tormented ruins? Let's go do the defiled catacomb. That I mean that sounds pretty cool, right? Like it's a defiled catacomb? Kind of wish there was. You know what? We should go sell this crap before we go do another dungeon. Let's let's fast travel over to Kaibasha and, and sell all this crap, and then you know come back here and then yeah. Best game plan, I think, is to do that. Kivoshad. Yeah, but I I, I passionately dislike the uh, the druid, but I've I've enjoyed all of the other classes. Maybe you guys did miss it. We have done a stream. Each night of the beta so far showing off every single one of the classes, and this is like basically the last one, I guess, because, you know, we're done everything, so. Yeah. Yeah, but Necro was a lot of fun last night. A lot of fun. Uh, let's also quickly increase how much health we get from this weird health person. Probably a good idea, right? You certainly have. If you've got the makings, I can mix you. You got the makings. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, let's go. I must wait a moment. Aww. Shred that guy? Which guy did I shred? Shredder? They added Shredder to, to Cod, right? Like, he's he's in that one. I must wait Does it look any good, Shredder, on that? Do I sell the rare stuff once you get legendaries? I just sell whatever is like not as good as what i have i really don't care i mean you know it's it's I a beta right like none of this like matters or sticks or anything like that so it's, it's completely irrelevant anything i do in these betas is just you know it's just to basically have like people watch and you know all that stuff it, it really doesn't matter at the end of the day the defiled catacombs Ooh. how was my day I was tired, I felt sickly, but I enjoyed what it was, and I went through it. Ah, ba -bum -ba -bum. Oh god, okay, I'm gonna take that thing off. Enter the cathedral. I already entered the Cathedral of Lights, so I'm gonna try to get rid of this. Enter what? Is that just glitched on my screen? Is enter the Cathedral of Light? 
Yeah, it's literally just bugged on my screen. Considering we already did that quest. Well, this place looks just haunting. Look at all the skeletons. Where would you get so many skeletons? A lot of people you'd have to have, like, I know it's a catacombs, but what, are they just, like, chucking the bodies into the corners and, like, just leaving them? Look at all the skeletons, dude. So there's a lot of skeletons. Like, a lot, a lot of skeletons. Like, an obscene amount. No wonder some of the skeletons became sentient. There's just so many of them. Way too many of them. Last chance to fight the world boss in about 40 minutes. Where, where do I go and witness this, this world boss? Where is he at? Where, where do I find this world boss? Like, what's he doing? Who's his pals? Or are you saying, like, it's gonna start in, like, 40 minutes? You gotta, you gotta be specific, you know? Specifics are everything. Especially in Diablo Land. But I'm very much looking forward to having like a really good character streaming this all at launch. Hopefully it's, you know, really, really popular on the channel. We can maybe do a bunch of playthroughs of the different characters and stuff, but we'll we'll see what happens. But I, I think it's it's gonna be a really good long-term game to, to really kind of cover periodically. A, a door has been unsealed. Big dragon? Like, so he appears in like 40 minutes, or is I will see a timer. Like, on my screen, it'll just pop up. Alright, well, if he shows up and we're playing, I guess we'll go maybe kill him. It could be fun. Yeah. And a Bateman attacking the poor people trying to enjoy the stream. <gasps> disc, disc. Level 25 Necro? Yeah, I really like doing the Necro. Where is Diablo Expert Kevin? He's got better things to do. I don't know, I, I haven't actually talked to Dev or to Dev to Kevin since the uh, since, since the stream or since the Diablo started last week actually I'm sure he's doing things that are of the utmost importance he's a busy guy Skeleton captain, as opposed to the cheery skeleton captains that we usually fight. It's actually probably more terrifying than having a skeleton or having a skeleton with a big smile on its face running towards you, trying to stab you. So we had to destroy skeletal constructs. A shocking skeleton. Is he shocking in appearance or shocking in his ability to create shockwaves at you or something? I'm frozen. This place looks fantastic though. I wish this was a dungeon in the other areas so we would have played it previously. Like it's so creepy looking with all the skeleton bones and cobwebs. Very, very cool looking. I'm a little surprised there's not more randomization to the dungeons though. You know what I mean? Like they're all pretty much the same thing every time you go through it. I feel like Diablo 3 had like a but much more variation on things. Uh, if you teleport to town and back, you might be able to do it twice. I don't know if I need to do it twice. Hmm. 
Well, hopefully we get to fight this boss. It would be pretty cool. Although it would be cool to play with another class, but you get what you get. The tumors of hatred were scarier. That's because those tumors are filled with hatred. Where the hell are these skeletal constructs I'm supposed to be destroying? I haven't come across a single one. It was a trap! A trap, I dare say. Can't go that way, we gotta keep going this way. There's more waves? Oh, I thought we killed all the waves. It's always unsettling when things come out of the ground because you know it was just there waiting for you the whole time. Why these creatures don't attack all at once, I don't know, but you know you deal with it. The dreadful skeleton corpse. Primitive token. Ah, that is quite an upgrade. Primitive token of your appreciation and love. That's a hard thing to find. I can switch to my favorite class. Ah, man. Tonight I embrace the druid life. This is the way. How have we come across no skeletal construct? We've been like really searching for a while too. Alright, there we go. There's one up here. Finally. I guess these skeletal constructs don't grow on trees. Could have fooled me. I'm a naughty boy. That's interesting. I like to think I'm a bit of a hero out here, you know, just being a, a druid. Trying to save the lands, despite this class being awful. Skull Crusher! Ah, oh, it's not as good as what I already have. I think that weapon needs a new name. Yeah, I can repair my weapons. Ah, uh, my stuff doesn't get that damage, considering I throw it away like it's useless every two seconds. I'm not ready yet. It's best to take my highest character. Uh, I'll do whatever character I have, and that's a druid. This is the druid stream, guys. They all get one. I'm not ready this is yet. druid's turn. Yeah, I really like the sorcerer. The the necromancer would be pretty top tier for doing it. We're gonna bring in the craptacular uh craptacular druid. We'll have its time to shine against the boss. Maybe you should try dying more, Zarcaster. I must wait a moment. I bet you the frickin' last one is all the way up here, isn't it? We'll see. We will see. Ooh, iron gates. Iron.
I mean, if it's a world boss, there's probably, what, there's gonna be like a public event? There should be other people there. I'm not ready yet. So I have to walk all the way back and go down there? You've got to literally be fucking kidding me. <laughs> like, you've, you've, you've literally got to be fucking kidding me. Okay. I guess we, we, we gotta backtrack a bit. We gotta backtrack a bit. <sighs> yeah, that sucks. There's no quick traveling in the dungeon either. You gotta walk. At least the wolves look like they're having fun. At least the wolves look like they're having fun. We're getting back, guys. We are we are making our way over there. I was like, should we check out this area? I'm like, you know, it usually makes you backtrack. I'm like, I'm gonna have to backtrack to go this way anyways. Ugh, jeez. I'm not ready yet. Yeah, sometimes things work for you and sometimes they don't. It's one of those sucks to suck moments. Yep. But we'll get there, guys. Only one skeletal remain left. Just a wee bit of walking. So I take it we still got... So when when will this countdown timer come? Yeah, I literally could have gotten this like two seconds. Oh. Well, I'll do this big world boss thing. Slay the gatekeeper. Jeffrey Fireball? Okay, well, that's an interesting name. Alright, let's walk all the way. <laughs> Just a wee bit of walking. Just gotta go on a bit of an adventure. No problem at all. We'll get there. We will get there. Hmm. I'm not ready yet. Also, I'm sure you guys will eventually have someone else that you can time out in the chat that causes problems. I'm sure that'll happen again at some point down the road. Uh, this is a sad ass wolf pack, is what this is. I never feel more lonely than I have when I have my wolves with me. I miss the Necro Bros, they were top tier. Yeah, the Necro Bros were where it's at. Anyways, guys, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes. It's like a buck to join. There's channel member gifting to gift others. The patron option. The Discord for stream alerts. If you're buying any game on that Xbox store, the Xbox affiliate link. And the Amazon Play Link for anything off the old Amazon land. Like your coffee. Pull on the lever before the giant spikes come up. Okay, the spikes got me. Let's go, wolves. We got a gatekeeper to slay. Can't imagine what this abomination is gonna look I like. Wait a moment. I need a key. Okay. So I gotta kill the key guy to open the gate to kill someone else? I must wait for There's the key, guys. We got it. It's a little bit of lonely solo dungeon crawling for tonight. Hmm. The skelly voice from Breakpoint? I don't, I don't even remember that being a thing in Breakpoint. Oh, I don't even... I try to forget Breakpoint. I try to forget some of these games that I dislike, and you guys always always bring it up just to, just to remind me of trauma. Defeat the Brood Guard. Okay. I'm not this, uh, this place definitely. Oh, it's a giant spider. Okay. 
I gotta say this this catacomb, they they nail the uh, the visual aesthetics, I gotta gotta say. Might be one of my favorite looking dungeons of the of Ada. Mix of skeletons and like spiders and crap, and spider webs and stuff. Very, very moody. God, this trip sucks. I'm not ready yet. Too bad they don't have a bard class. That's when you know they're getting fun, is, uh, is if they had a bard class, you know, because this is a live service, right? So that's that's the class I want to see added to Diablo is the bard class. I think that'd be absolutely hilarious. Because you know when, when Xbox owns them, they can do a, like a, a crossover with the bard's tale, eh? Wouldn't that just be cheeky and hilarious, just like doing musical battles and stuff? Filed catacombs has been finished. Now we go back to the sanctuary. So we still have the tormented ruins. And apparently there's supposed to be a world boss, but I don't see that popping up yet. Yeah. You guys, where's where's this world boss at? I thought you guys said it was supposed to be coming up soon. There's this cash. Yeah, I don't see any. I don't. I don't see anything like that. Oh, you can hold X to reset your dungeons. Lovely. Would that change like the design of the dungeons? Oh, what is this? Begins in 23 minutes. A Shava the Pestilent. Is this who we're gonna fight? Is a Shava? Baldur's Gate 3 is a bard class? Yeah, except Baldur's Gate 3 is cutting us off, or us poor Xbox people off. 23 minutes. Okay, so we have time to go and do this dungeon over here. Then we'll go ready to do the world balls. And the shadow work in this game is so good. The tormented ruins of beyond. All right, let's go, Wolf Team. I'm not ready yet. Slay Adger Adelgrim and collect the tower key. I didn't realize that we were in a tower of power. That's exciting. But yeah, I think basically after we clean out this area, you will have seen almost everything this beta has had to offer. You know, between the different stream nights, we did all the top map areas, all the bottom map areas. Bloodthirsty bone. Why would a skeleton be bloodthirsty? Or is that just the label we've given that poor skeleton? The wolf pack's kind of fun though. Corpses explode? What? What do you mean corpses explode? What are you talking about exploding corpses? 
I should start a career in playing video games. Yeah, I should. But then again, so many people tell me I'm so bad at it. Guard of the gate, okay. What was he swinging at there? Power to open the gate. Where's the gate at? Oh, it's, oh it's, I assume it's down here. Okay. Let's get it done. By D4, you mean dark dreams don't die? You bet your ass. That was actually pretty funny. I was on... I can't remember what it was. The one forum today. Someone's like... The fallout from the, the Xbox Activision Blizzard purchase was going to be... You know, felt by PlayStation users for years. And someone's like... Uh, no it won't, because Fallout will only be on Xbox, and I was like, oh! <laughs> I was like, that's, that's, that's cheeky, that's, that's really, really good. He had D4. Yeah, D4 is already on Game Pass, you know, Dark Dreams Don't Die. I, is, actually, is D4 on Game Pass? First party, it should be. At least it's, well, maybe not first party, it's Xbox published, I suppose. Travel to the Chamber of Calling. Or Calling, sorry. Not to be confused with the Chamber of Culling. A Pit Lord? I'm playing as a druid tonight. That's that's what we're stuck with. So you know, you, you get what you get, right? I actually really like Dark Dreams Don't Die, and I was a little disappointed that that video got absolutely overrun by the madness that was the Far Cry 5 update. Yeah. So if you guys didn't see the Dark Dreams Don't Die video, pretty cool. And again, Dark Dreams Don't Die is, is actually pretty well done. I really wish we would have gotten the uh, the full story, obviously. Xbox kind of screwed them over a little bit. Does anyone know what the Chamber of Calling is like? Is it like, call me on the line? You know, like the song, call me? A little, little, little bit of blondie? Man, I've not gotten a better, cooler weapon in a long time. Ooh, a blast wave. Awesome. I love this one. This is my favorite shrine ability. Because you can just, like, stand beside a bunch of guys and just, like, and just slaughters them all. Oh, hopefully we can do this before the boss fight. Go, 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 go! Run! Scourge of the land. More like you're gonna be the dead of the land. <laughs> oh, I love that blast ability. Okay, well that, that finished that one. Okay. Hmm. Alrighty, so let's go. How, how much time do we have till this big boss thing goes on? Uh, 
da, da. Okay, so we finished all of the dungeons here, right? So this area, this starts in 16 minutes? Oh my god, we still have a lot of time. You heard Cyberpunk's next updates in April? Is it like an update or is the expansion finally coming out? It is a bit of a walk. I don't think it would take 16 minutes to get there though, right? How do you enter that from in there? I guess we could go take a look at it. Am I getting attacked? What do I pay you wolves for? I mean, I guess we gotta go sell this stuff anyways. Alright, we'll, we'll head over there, I, I suppose. We'll, we'll head over to this magical place of this boss fight. We're just talking about some D4, you know, Dark Dreams Don't Die. It's a classic. Do not feed that foolish dog. She was meant to be a hunter. I'm sorry, that dog is useless to you. Not all dogs are meant for the hunt. Good price. I've got 165. How, how do I spend my $160,000 that I have in this game? You know, before the beta ends. 14 minutes. I feel like we're going to get there too fast. Yeah. Probably come out. Well, like, the expansion is supposed to be coming out at some point, so... Keep in mind, like, the expansion was supposed to come out, like, the following year of when, like, the game came out. Like, it's it's been hugely delayed, if you think about it. I'm sure it'll be a big hit. I'm actually looking forward to the, uh... The Horizon Forbidden West expansion, where you go to Los Angeles. That should be fun. Ooh, look, pants in the wilderness, guys. It's a good thing these weird demonic ghouls drop pants for me. Sometimes better pants, sometimes worse pants. What is there? A stash expansion? Yay! That's what I've always needed is to expand my stash of things that I've never even used. I slayed 5,000 vampires? Dude, I've been going on like a tear in this freaking beta. 5,000 vampires. I'm like the bane of the vampiric world. They're like, who is this guy? They called Dracula. He's like, this dude's killed like 5,000 of us. In a beta. Doesn't even matter. We're getting some leveling out. We can go do this uh, world event before we go do this boss fight, right? We still got time. Yeah. Kind of figured my wolves would be able to do something beforehand. Yeah, there's still 12 minutes left. Let's, let's do this. I must wait I was kind of hoping it would be daytime, though, when we go to do this battle. You know what I mean? It's so... Hard to see what it's dark out there. A druid spirit offering? Oh wow. That was cool. Whatever that does. They're working really hard on it this time? I'm sure they are. Wear my pants? See, the funny thing is, you guys always just assume I'm wearing pants, which is hilarious. I mean, you don't know. You don't know anything about what I'm doing. I am a mystery. <gasps> Ooh. Don't 
die, Carver Shaman. I must wait a moment. Here we go, guys. Here we go. The Crucible, level 25 plus. Begins in 10 minutes? Oh my god. Hey look, there's another dude here. He's level 25. That's nice. Oh, that looks really unsettling. This guy's level 5, that's cool. This guy's level 10. Everybody's kind of getting ready for this. Got my wolf pack. Got my wolf crew. Wait, could I like portal to here, upgrade my stuff, and then come back? I bet I could, right? Ah, oh, who cares? Look, as a werewolf, Sue is just standing there. That's a rogue, I believe. Yeah. You max out the Barbarian? Nah, that's nice. The Necromancer was, was just awesome yesterday when we did that. Cyberware features? I just want a new game plus on Cyberpunk so I can restream it and bask in the glory of all the views that Cyberpunk brings in. And I enjoy Cyberpunk, so it'd be fun to replay it again. Again, again, yeah. Like, I guess we could start another play, but it's kind of like, I'd rather keep all my stuff. So these guys are just gonna chill out for like nine minutes. I mean, I, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go scout out this area. I mean, we got nine minutes. We're just not just gonna stand here. I don't think. The Druid or the Incredible Hulk? The Hulk is way more powerful. Than, the Druid just sucks as a character class. Like I, I really do dislike playing as this character. Uh, yeah, literally all the other classes are infinitely better than this one. Yeah. Seriously, it's it's just like it. It is a big difference. Okay, so we've got nine minutes. We'll go do this event right here. This this is perfect. There's like a world event that we can do. That should kill some time. Yeah, this this is good. We got this. Blood is the key. So we are your likes on the stream. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member, cool perks, cool votes, cool features. You feel better than other people as a member. Or so I've heard. There's channel member gifting, there's the Patreon option, there's the Discord if you wanna get stream alerts to know when the streams are going on. As YouTube does a horrible job of telling people. There's the Xbox store, if you're buying any game on there, the affiliate link will take you to the Microsoft store at negative percentage. I mean, you're probably buying games digitally anyways. And there's the Amazon playbook for anything on good old Amazon. Like coffee beans or that cool scarf for your alpaca. I'm not here to judge. But I want to. One pressure plate left, guys. They're gonna have to buff the druid. Uh, yeah, buff it or take it out of the game. It's literally that uncommon. There's a secret hidden up there. Actually, wait, we we did. I don't think there's any dungeons really or anything too crazy that we haven't already done over there. Murmuring obols. Ooh. Tomorrow should be a fun day, though, with succession to watch. Do you think they're finally going to succeed their papa? It's going to be a hell of a battle. Alright, guys. Six, seven minutes. The, the time is almost upon us. Will they fix characters down the road? I mean, I'm sure they're gonna do updates and change things and adjust stuff, but I'm just saying, like, I really find the Druid, like, that useless, and then I'm just kind of like, you might as well just take it out. Give me my Paladin back. 
And, uh, yeah, like I said, I, I saw Dungeons and Dragons today, so I would actually oh, love for them to games. add a, uh, a bear, a bard class would be funny. Especially with the Xbox ownership coming in, you know, do like a, the bard's tail kind of tie-in would be hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Six minutes left. Where are all the people that were here earlier? Now it's just Fugo. Were there like eight people here? Where did all the guys go? Is it because I left and, you know, now there's only two other folks. Did they all disconnect or something? Wait a moment. Seriously, there was like 15 people that were like waiting here. Or did I teleport into another instance because I left and came back? Is that how that works? It's probably how that works, isn't it? Can I like dance? Hello. Impressive. <laughs> well done. I could use some assistance. <laughs> I could use some assistance. <laughs> I need help. Hello. <laughs> The beast lives within you. <laughs> oh, this, this is my favorite part of doing like multiplayer games is this dumb stuff, like the interactions. Would be welcome. Oh, someone's got a lot of necro bros. We're just kind of like teaming up here. <laughs> We're squatting up, guys. Oh. The beast Demon class and the paladin class. I don't care who they add, man. I just I just want my paladin class back. Yeah, I appreciate that. Is there any spawn point in the eastern part of the map? Ah, uh, there's like Yelnezna, the Bear Tribe. I don't think there's anything closer to my knowledge. Thank you. Like up here is the Vampire Academy. So yeah, I, I think this is this is as good as it gets. This gonna be pure darkness doing this. Anyways, let's prepare for battle. You guys ready? Is everybody excited? I'm here with my emotional support guinea pig. Weak weak. Teddy's ready to go. Are you guys ready to go? Ah, oh, he's so comfy. Oh god, this is gonna be so nice just to pass out tonight. I might have to pick up some season two ones. Oh look at the, there's so many people here. We got like a whole squad. Hello. Well done. Aid would be welcome. We can zoom in guys. Then you can see all the people and their abilities. Oh somebody actually did leave us. A lot of necromancer classes out there. That guy's eating way too much. He needs to cut back. He needs to have some new fitness goals, is what I'm saying. Philia. Look, guys, it's Philia. That's Phil's gal counterpart, alter ego. Philia. Yeehaw. You don't see me, Zarcaster? Wow. Probably because you're not in the same instance because he didn't like join my same like squad thing. <laughs> He's on the screen. I am on the screen. That's very, very true. If you guys are wondering why we're standing around like an idiot, it's because the, the boss battle was in like two minutes. The world boss battle. And apparently it's the last one. This guy's got purple armor. My armor looks so lame. Greetings. Oh wow, look at that orange ability. That's pretty cool. Imagine how different the characters are going to look during, like, world boss battles when everybody's, like, you know, max level when the full game comes out. It's going to be pretty sweet. You think they'll have, like, raids? Like, really big, like, you know, large multi-group raid setups? That would be interesting. Alright, it's a minute and a half, guys. This is what it all comes down to. This is why we flight. Everybody get ready. 
Do you think this thing's gonna come up and just like monstrously slaughter us? Like how many people do we have here? We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm eight, right? There's only like eight of us here. It's the final countdown. So this thing's just gonna be like an absolute monstrosity, right? Am I the lowest level here? 15, no, somebody's a little bit lower than I am. Should've brought out the Necromancer, but tonight's stream is the Druid stream, so it's the Druid's turn to go and die. That orange power looks like Lord of the Rings eyeball. You mean the Eye of Sauron one? Drop Zone is a crazy game mode, it is. Did they add Drop Zone to Modern Warfare 2 too? Is that added in there now? You're really good at raids? Oh, you and Slaughter Filet, you guys are the, the best raiding squad mates one could ask for. Yeah. I don't know if you're doing well there, Joe. Been a while. Oh, you're, you're feeling bad because you timed somebody out and they're not here anymore? <laughs> you guys gotta be careful with your timeouts. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, guys. Let's do it. Oh, did Philia leave? Here it is, guys! It's coming! It's coming from the green! <gasps> it zoomed out! Whoa! Ashava the Pestilent! I didn't know this game had a further zoom out angle. They did really wow. No, I haven't played Marvel 52 in a while. There's been too many new things to cover. Maybe I should have brought the Necromancer in. Go wolves, go! I'm not ready. This is kind of cool though, getting all these people together for this, like, this really wouldn't have been quite possible in a, a past Diablo game. <laughs> hey, my wolves respawn too, that's nice. Go wolves, go! You get a feeling that this boss is like really tough. He's insta killing me, guys. <laughs> he's, he's he's a tough dude. He's, he's a very very tough guy. Oh look, there's like little dragon thing shooting fire from the ground, like little sentries. Is there like a time limit? Oh, we've got like 13 minutes to kill this thing. Reminds me of like World of Warcraft. I'd always go to, a, to what is it, Mitchell's house, and then watch his like old man just sit there and like do like crazy ass World of Warcraft like raids against dragons. It was just the coronation stuff was miraculous. It was always very impressive, needless to say. I'm dead again. Yeah, no, he's 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 crushing me, he's slicing me, he's he's just taking my ass out. Well we've almost taken out a quarter of his health. <laughs> Had my wolves in one bite. This is incredible. I love this. This is so cool. We're all like just going at it. This is a huge squad here. You know you're an important part of the team when the the dragon takes time to personally eat you alive and your your dogs. 
Go werewolves, go! Alright, sorry, no, they're not werewolves, they're just wolves. Wish they were werewolves, that would be cool. Go squad, go! This is pretty epic though, right? Ashava, you must die. Hey, that guy's legendary trash. Oh, you know what I named my druid today? Because no one asked. Uh, I called him Drew. <laughs> Get it? Because it's a druid? Funny. I don't know if we're going to kill this guy in time, you know what I mean? Like, it's been three minutes and we've only taken out like a sliver of his health. They're, they're kicking our asses here. Hard to see the boss attack, he just kills you guys. He eats you, he slaps you, he slashes you, you just accept death. I wonder if he's gonna win, because it's still 75%. I don't know if we're gonna kill this thing or not. I think he's gonna beat us. Or is that just like a time for bonuses? <laughs> Drew, Rin, Pure Dizzy, Drew, Slain. Your items are close to breaking. You can repair items for gold and a blacksmith. That's that's lovely. Well, if it breaks, it breaks. Yeah, he's drew the druid. I. I thought it was clever. Oh, come on, I just came back. Yeah, I'm like getting eaten alive by this pestilence. This is a shop of the, pe shop of the pestilence. Go swear, Tokyo. Yeah, I, I gotta email in to see if they're doing codes for that or not. Because, like, Xbox doesn't seem to handle Bethesda stuff. Like, you actually have to go through, like, the traditional Bethesda channels to get, like, Bethesda games. It's weird. It's like, what's the point of owning them if we don't get those perks? Reviewing wise. I must wait a moment. Makes me actually wonder like how Redfall and like, Starfield are gonna be handled. Like, do I have to go through the Bethesda people or is Xbox gonna look me up? It's weird. It's, it's very, very strange, honestly. Your equipment is fully broken. I don't have time to repair my equipment. I'm not ready yet. <laughs> he's, he's teaching me a lesson in pain. I got a complete lesson in pain. Question is, are the rest of my teammates dying as much? Not that my armor was, uh, you know, doing a whole lot of good for me anyways, against this thing. Go by wolves, attack! Hey guys, we almost got him down to, you know, no, that would be 40% health. We're making a difference. We're getting them. I can do it, I hope so. We'll see. I think we're running out of time. They brought an ice breaking this game. Uh yeah, I don't know. It's it's something. I mean it's probably gonna be part of the whole armor economy that they're gonna be building and stuff, right? It just adds an extra dimension of like things for you to do. 
If I have 0% armor, how does the armor keep going down further? Because <laughs> I always found that annoying when I was like trying to do the Elder Scrolls Online back in the day. It's like, it's way better now, but like, you know, I, I couldn't get ahead because I kept like losing armor every time I died. And I was like, well, what the hell? I remember that being a pain when I was trying to review something. A lot of dying. Are other people dying this much? Kill the pestilent. Give it her all she's got out here, guys. Oh, he just he just backswept me. He backswept me like it was nothing. <sighs> I'm back alive. We've almost got it down to like 25% health, guys. We are making a difference. That's that back sweep thing gets me like every time. You know what I mean? Like it just it just like sneaks up on you, it just goes whoosh and just cuts your asses. Killed it and didn't even level up at all. Go wolves, go! Oh jeez. That back sweep gets me like every single time. Jeez. Has anyone keep, kept track of the total number of deaths I have in here? Guys, you brought him back to the spawn point. That's not good. Oh, come on! I'm back. Yeah, I did love it when we did Diablo 2 there with Kevin, and we just kept doing suicide runs to kill the spider thing. That was always fun. If you guys haven't seen our Diablo 2 streams, like Diablo 2 Resurrected, they were very entertaining. Kevin would get so pissed how I played these games, or how I played that one. Okay. Man, I hate that, like, backslash stab thing. If the back sweep doesn't get you if you're between his legs, I'll try to keep that in mind. I think we've almost killed it, though. I, I think we've almost got this boss killed. Pretty cool thing though, I, I gotta say, I'm, I'm glad I checked this out. Oh, I thought I was gonna dodge that. I wanna be there for when it dies. We killed it, guys! It's so cinematic, is it gonna explode with all this candy? Loot! Now it's all dark and sad and cold. Ashaba, the pestilent, you are dead. We did it. Well done. Is that it? There are so many ways I can kill you. Well, that's that's not very nice. Do we take pictures up against this dead corpse? Impressive. 
Mm, okay. Efficient. That does that all now? Greetings. Anyways, guys, be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes. There's channel member gifting. There's the Patreon option. The Discord if you want to stream alerts to so know when the streams are going on. There's the Xbox Store affiliate link for Xbox game purchases and the Amazon affiliate link for anything on Amazon. Hey, right, well, I guess we go back to town then. Is that it? That's that's all. Okay. Procure armored weapons, right? Well, it was nice being part of a, a big squad in this. I actually really liked that. It was like a cool collective uh, kind of thing that you know, the, the the world events. They're kind of fun. Level 16, so I'm not even good enough to wear some pants. Imagine being like, you're, you know, slightly worthless that you can't even wear a type of pants. The hell? I want my items. What the, what the f I, I clicked the portal? <sighs> yeah, it is, it's gonna be a long wait till, uh, till June with the full release of this game. Fingers crossed that the deal goes through Xbox, uh, and you know maybe I get some early access stuff would be cool. Yeah, we'll see. I guess I don't know how reviews are gonna work for this one. I don't know if they're gonna give it to us at launch because it's like a live, you know, like a multiplayer game, or if it's gonna be like any sort of early access. I really have no idea. Yeah, imagine that, going to a store and being like, you're not a high enough level to wear these pants. I'd be like, this is ridiculous. Okay, so I've got all this stuff I can't use, so that's that's lovely. Hmm, okay, let's, let's see if we can find a, a cooler dungeon or something that we can do. Anything else? Uh, let's go uh, also see the blacksmith because apparently all my armor is broken. Actually, this are you the armor? No, you're the armor vendor. Where is the blacksmith at? Blacksmith, where are the? There is a blacksmith in town, right? Rings and amulets, stash, wardrobe, weapons, purveyor of goods. This is there. There's no blacksmith in town, really. That's weird. Hmm. The loot is in my stash. There's more loot in my stash. Oh. Okay, well, I'll go take a look at that. But I'm going to repair my armor first. Armor dude, I need my armor repaired. That there's worth Thank you, our blacksmith dude. Let's, let's go hit up that stash and see what we can get, and then find a dungeon, I guess. Dungeon could be fun. If you guys have any dungeon recommendations, I'm pretty sure I've done all of them after today. I think I've accomplished all of the uh, the dungeons across my different streams of this, so we'll see how it goes. Okay, I'll check out my stash. They, they give us a nice room, at least. Ooh. Ah. Oh, and your wardrobe, so you can change, like, the look of it. Ah. And you can buy ensembles. I've got lots of money. I can have all the ensembles, guys. Oh, you can change your appearance at any time. God, my guy is, like... Yeah, he's, he's a little he's a little chunky. He, 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 could, he could lose some weight, I think. I spent 100,000. There we go, guys. I now have... A bigger item slot. Ooh, for all the items I don't have. Alright, let's go and do a dungeon. So we did that one. We did that one. Not with this character, but with other characters. The Sanguine Chapel. Have we done... I don't know if we've done that one. Yeah, I, I don't think we've done that one. Okay, let's let's go and uh, go do that. Yeah, that's that's cool. Vampires. Yeah, I, I got the loot, guys. Don't worry, I got one in the stash. 
Tam, he's thick. Get the salvage items, get the look. Uh, yeah, I am aware of that as well. I, I, did, I did read about the little promo bits on that thing, but yeah, thanks. Uh, okay, so I've got uh, this amulet to sell. Actually, can I slot this on anything? Okay, cool, 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 cool. All right, right on. Okay, let's go and uh, go check out this because I don't know. I don't like the Sanguine Chapel. I can't remember if I've done that one or not. Because if you if you don't know, I've I've done streams of like every single one of the characters each night. So like this is the last character I have to do. So I've basically seen everything, done everything. So many items to collect. That's the whole point of this is to to loot and stuff like that. Yeah, certain items will have the whole salvage to gain this uh, this look and stuff. So that kind of makes me wonder, well, like, you know, because obviously they shared coin in the beta. Will the full game have shared coin? That would be interesting. Definitely make it easier to get your secondary characters kind of going. I'm gonna miss that world boss, guys. That was fun. Were there other world bosses during the, the beta, or was that like the big one that was present? Because we also did all the stronghold stuff the other night. Good wolves. Their bark is intense. Going commando. I'm just a simple druid. Although in all seriousness, I, I do really quite dislike this class. I, yeah, every every one of the other classes is better. In so many ways. If I, if I was to tell you that uh, this class grew on me, I'd, I'd just be lying. Although I do like my wolf pack. but they're nothing compared to skeletons and wandering wraiths that follow you and support you emotionally and, you know, physically and all that. Only a Shava? Hmm. Oh, these are bad guys following me. I was like, my crew is so large, and then I'm like, no, no, we're not, we're not Necromorphs. I'm gonna die in the, uh, being frozen. That was close. I almost had to let it go. Uh, very heavy, like resistance, even getting to this dungeon. But honestly, uh, it's been fun playing the Diablo beta. I, I eagerly await the full game. And I think my coverage is done good enough. Well, I probably end up reviewing this one as well. I, I think the only big disappointment is not having uh, our pal Kevin there jump in. But we did have a uh, little slaughter there. Slaughter and things, so you, know, you, you take what you can get. I'm not ready. Gotta be getting close. To the, yeah, we're, we're getting close. I was like, man, this thing seems far away. Am I winning? I don't know if I feel like I'm winning, but you know. Ooh. Ah. Come on, wolf pack, let's do this. It is locked. I need a whispering key. Into the chapel. Playing Alan we still need to do a stream of the Alan Wake remaster. It'll come in due time. I'll eventually get to everything I need to get to. It is the way of things. It's just when I uh, have a day that I want to sit there and do an 11 hour stream, this is when, uh, when we'll mulch through Hell and Wake. The bloated corpse of fiend.
Too bad you can't like queue up and like find people to like do stuff with like this. You know what I mean? Like just sit at the beginning of the dungeon and be like, do you want to play with others? And it could like find you a bunch of people. That'd be kind of cool. Temporary team ups, especially since it's so multiplayer oriented, right? That'd be a pretty easy thing for them to add. Return the mechanical box to the pedestal. So that's another one of those. Okay. Apparently, I skipped all the dungeons at previous screen that we had to bring crap to places. We'll get it done. Yeah, Alan Wake 2 is this year. They did uh, confirm that in their latest investor meeting or whatever. Alan Wake 2 is on the way. Uh, Control 2 is in pre development. And I guess the remakes of Max Payne 1 and 2 are going to be like a single game. And they're just currently scoping those out. So that's interesting. Makes me wonder if uh, Take Two is gonna have someone else shove out a uh, Max Payne 3 remaster or something, like a quick one. You know, not like remakes like the first two games are getting, but yeah. I got some new ah, these war pants stuff. So. Shambling corpses. Ancient totems, am I right? Where do you keep finding these things? <sighs> Matchmaking for dungeons and story missions? Yeah, it'd be kind of cool. You know what I mean? I think it'd be a nice little touch. I mean, like I said, though, with it, with it being so like heavily multiplayer focused, you think it'd be a pretty easy thing for them to add in, right? Or it would be more of a, a focus of them would be like trying to integrate everything into multiplayer. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what they do with the final release. But I'm sure the response for this beta has been extremely positive, so I don't think they'll change too much from what we got here. But yeah, I think this could be probably a game of the year contender, and it's probably going to be one of the highest selling games of the year too. I think this one will be a big, big hit. Yeah. Alan woke. <laughs> Alan awoke. Oh man. It's kind of funny. I don't know. I'm, I'm sure Alan Wake 2 will be good. I mean probably something they've been planning for a very, very long time, so. I know I've been waiting for it for a long time, so I hope it's the right You gotta kill somebody for me. Ah, they just bit that dude. Bark, bark, yo, yo. Can I, like, turn that off? There we go. I hate having all these, like, things on my UI. Like that stuck Enter the Cathedral of Light thing that's been there all game that I can't get rid of because I've already finished the quest. That's a little annoying. Don't like extra UI elements. Yeah. Dirty pants? Oh yeah. 
All right, we got one more box to get. You know, when I think of vampires, I don't necessarily think of giant bloated fat dudes exploding, but I guess vampires have to evolve with the times. <laughs> oh wait, but I, I can slot these into these weapons I can use down the road? That actually might save me some space. That is way better than that is. Hmm. Diablo to be on Game Pass. Yeah, that's, that should be nice. I don't know if, like, it's. I really don't feel that they're gonna get the deal done in time to, like, make it on Game Pass Day 1, but it would be a pretty good get, especially if they could, like, maybe not Day 1, but, like, literally at E3 be like, Diablo's coming to Game Pass now or something would be pretty good. Although it might piss people off that bought it in the first week or something. We'll see. Because it's like, what, June 6th for this? And then E3 is like the week after? Uh, nah, I think the E3 plans will also be pretty set in stone as of like April is usually when they get that all wrapped up and kind of like pre planned. Oh, he's, he's got a sword in me! Jeez, that's a large sword. It's unsettling, actually. Bill of Morality, what? Yeah, is, is this like, this is a weird bill. This is like something you'd see in the US. Is it gonna get off of my screen or? Is it just kinda, it's kinda stuck on my screen forever now or what? Okay, well, the, the year of light. So we've buried 92 souls on these hollow grounds. Why is there a 54 for removal of blood? It's just kind of stuck up on there now, or do we have to get rid of that? Good day, hello there. Oh, now it's gone, that's good. <laughs> I, was a little, I was a little worried there. I'm like, is that gonna be stuck for the rest of this play? I must wait a moment. The Defiled Undercroft. Better than the Defiled Overcroft, I always say. See, the thing is, with the druid, I don't even feel like I'm becoming more powerful at all. You, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's just... Ugh. It's like a slow, somber, cumbersome class. Kill him. Kill him fast. The aesthetics of these rooms very beautiful how's there like light getting in through like some of the windows or is there windows Diablo you go to such dark decrepit places a lot of shambling corpses I thought this was vampires it's like everything but vampires in here I guess it also deter or is based on like what they determined to be like quote unquote a vampire. My inventory is getting like full. Three hundred and twenty-six. Two hundred and twenty-two. Oh, that's that's way better than that one. Rabies have been granted to you by an item. I have rabies? Yay? This is what I've always wanted. Rabies. Lovely. 
Hmm. Alright. Okay. Well, I got a new staff thing that kills people more effectively. Why would you get rid of your poor PS5? Or are you waiting for the pro? Anyways, it's been a while. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing's great. Donations, cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool emotes, cool things. There's channel member gifting, the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts, the Xbox Store affiliate link, and the Amazon affiliate link as well. How do I get... Oh, I gotta slay all the enemies. We got this. I must wait a minute. Oh, I forgot you can do the electric jump like end of attack. I feel like there is a lack of enemies to really make that feel effective. Is everybody dead? Can we go into the the chamber of mortality? That's unsettling. Hmm. Oh, look how this place is lit. The Blood Bishop. Okay, let's do it, Blood Bishop. It's got my my wolves attacking the blood blisters. That was kind of funny. He's sucking my blood. Kill him, wolves. Kill him. Sucks the suck giant thing. The sanctuary. I wonder if there's like a good dungeon down here we could do. I don't know, I'm just trying to find like new activities we can jump into. Hmm. Yeah, it's talking about hug mode. Hug mode for those deeper hugs. Okay, I got a lot of crap to sell. So negative two hundred and two damage. So we can get rid of that. What else you want? That's still locked, so that might be useful. I mean, to be fair, I, I might as well just sell everything. Like, it's it's a beta. It's not like we're ever going to be able to use this stuff again. Alright, let's see if there's some kind of, like, dungeon down in this area that we can go take in. Guild. I love how it still says the Cathedral of Light. I guess they just got some little UI bugs to clean up on those, eh? Some little ones. How is this Diablo game? It's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Although the druid sucks. A howling den. Lovely. It'd be pretty sick to play, you know, because Xbox does the cloud gaming with like the phones and stuff. It'd be pretty cool to stream Diablo to, like your I'm phone, right? Yet. Hmm. Well, that was challenging? Is that a word you would use for that? Challenging? Probably not. Other than the druid? Yeah, seriously, I hate the I freaking hate this druid, man. Your ISP? Ooh, look at you, big ISP player. Hmm. Yeah, I'm looking to see if there's any more dungeons going on. I wish there was another big boss world event going on. That would be cool. Jump over the waterfall. 
An altar of Lilith. Intelligence has been increased by two for all characters as well. Right on. Didn't realize we were having an intelligence issue. Zeleni Lowlands. I must wait a moment. Come on, I, there's gotta be like a dungeon around here, right? There we go, Dead Men's Dredge. We could do that. That seems like a lovely spot. I leveled up too. Mmm, wrath skills. Maybe that'll make the Druid class good guys. I doubt it, but you never know. You never know. Hmm. Well, in especially in like the US from what I understand is like if you go with certain companies they can give you good deals on certain things and they all set that up and that if you guys didn't know that sort of thing. So it's usually a US thing, that's how they get you over, is they give you treats and toys and TVs and crap. Oh there we go, fully charged. Hmm. So I've been without my phone for hours. It's unsettling, actually. Ah, the Dead Man's Dredge. Collect Animus from Animus Carriers. Whatever the hell that means. This looks like a rocky, creepy cave place. Filled with ghouls. Lovely. I'm not ready yet. Oh, Animus Carrier means giant, weird, creepy guy that we need to kill. Got it. Ooh, ripped him into one. Holy. Where bear attack? The real were bear is the were bear inside. Has the druid got any better from the level ups? Not really. Not really at all. I mean, he's like, he's more effective, I guess, but it's just, it hasn't made the class any more fun to play. Like, the wolves you have barely do anything. I'd, I'd way rather have the, the Necromancer. <laughs> like, maybe there's a cool set of skills and stuff, and I just don't have them. I don't know, but like, yeah, this has not been like... This has been my least enjoyable class to play as by, like, quite a bit. I actually rather like playing literally all the other classes a lot, to the point where I was like, I don't know which one I like the most because they're so similar in, like, enjoyment. It was a trap! I hate when the conduits are traps. Spiders, what is this? Hogwarts Legacy? Debating on if I want to bother that poppy voice actress one last time. The last book like two weeks ago. She was like, oh yeah, yeah, blah blah blah, and I was like, mm, okay.
My god, new items! Oh, that was kind of crazy how that flew across the, uh, the map area there. That looked pretty cool. My conduit's a lot of fun to use. Huh. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Got some better boots, guys. Some better boots. Do I want? Oh no, okay, this way. Because I was like, do I want to go that way or do I want to go this way? I'm like, no, this is the way to go. Deposit the animus into the animus urn. Okay. Blood boils. Love boils. Travel to the slaughter. We know Slaughter, guys. We know that, dude. <laughs> he bailed on us to get some sleep. Like a responsible adult. How could he? Come on, guys. It's one one star Boyric work. I think you guys could kill it. What do I pay these wolves with? Or what do I pay them for, really? Free the prisoners, okay. How would you become a prisoner of these wolf things? It's a little odd, but okay, we'll, we'll free some prisoners. Okay, those prisoners look like they're stuck on pikes. Oh, he's a butcher. So they're more like food as opposed to like prisoners? Oh, this guy is actually freaking tough. Anytime you wolves want to like step in and give me a hand here? Oh my god. This dude is terrifying. Look at this. Get him, wolves! This actually might be one of the, the tougher bosses I fought. Why is this butcher so terrifying? I am out of potions. Oh, here we go. The healing well. That's helpful. Very convenient that that healing well was still there waiting for me. This guy seems like a weird, uh... Out of nowhere, kind of like high level difficult dude to fight. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is terrifying actually. For like low level crap that's absolutely worthless. Alright, that's the legendary ring, 336. 323. Okay. 
little, little unsettling, but we, we got the job done. Hmm. He pops up randomly. Is there a cow level? I mean, there's probably going to be a cow level, right? Probably just not available in the beta. Ugh, man, that guy was tough. Especially with how useless this druid is. <laughs> okay. That was close. It was mostly because I had that, uh, you know, hell thing there to bail my ass out of that. Oh, the butcher. Now it's like quaintly kind of quiet in these tunnels, like unsettlingly quiet. Hmm. <gasps> but I want the cool chest. A ring of power? That one's got purpley spikes on it. All this stuff sucks compared to that cool loot I got from the world boss. Which makes sense, I guess. I don't know. I just want more loot, you know? More loot. Oh yeah, we're saving prisoners. <gasps> Was that a loot golem? Guys, it's a loot golem. Or, sorry, a treasure golem, my bad. Don't want to get his name wrong. You know how these treasure golems are. Haha! <laughs> treasure for me! Yeah, just imagine being some guy that's been, like, stranded here, and the butcher is gonna, like, cut you up into making you food, and there's a hero that can save your life, but he's too busy, like, collecting loot from a loot golem to, like, come and help you. Kind of funny. He's low priority, what can I say? Very low priority. Oh, bless you. There's a zone event in four minutes? Where, Filet? Where is the zone event? Tell me where I can find a zone event to do. Because I can tell you where you can find a like event that's here on the stream. Be sure to like the stream. Subscribing is great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool icons. You feel like you've paid to win. But on the stream, there's the Patreon option, the Discord for stream alerts. Thanks. The, yeah, Xbox Store affiliate link and the Amazon affiliate link too. I know, crazy, what a feeling. Fiery Voldemort. Where's this world event though? A lethal shrine? Bless you. Prisoner remains? Why would we have to free the prisoner remains? We're laying him to rest. Do we really have time to do that? Man, my god must have too much time on his hands. Yes, yeah, so let's free this dude that skeleton remains. That's that's great. It's what we do, guys. We're heroes. They took that right out of Minecraft Dungeons, the, the mushrooms. The mushrooms were awesome. I was so proud to have a video of that, like, right away available. Hey look, there's snakes going around, guys. Snakes. I, I killed the snakes. My bad. They got in the way. What can I say? My burden is too great. 
I don't have space. I don't... I want those sturdy boots. They're worse. Oh my god, okay. So that dungeon's complete? Now what do I do? I go back to the sanctuary. Hmm. It's on the map. Where on the map is this event? Come on, dude. You gotta do better than that. Lay. Yeah, gotta do better than that. I'll take it. Good. What else you want? Hey, at least I'm making my money back. see a world event anywhere. God, I feel like Filet doesn't know what he's actually talking about. Is it just me or is Filet a filthy casual? Bring back Philia, guys. Bring back Philia. Philia. Hey, is this like a new area we haven't been to? Ooh. Play as many enemies as you can before the time runs out, okay. Hello. I do like these public events. They're kind of they're a little fun connection. I appreciate that. Farewell. Hmm. Should we go up or should we go to the left? Let's go to the left. We've got an area to explore, guys. The Western Tunnels. Luna Cobb. Spooky. I mean, sellers are usually quick. The flooded mine. Looks very moist in here. Purge the cellar, it shall be done. That was easy. It doesn't feel very purged with enemies still attacking me within a day. Gives off that kind of like not totally purged vibe. You, you get what I'm saying? Batgirl? Batgirl's ray trace the rear end. Hmm. <laughs> ray tracer. <laughs> oh, that one always just kills me. Absolutely kills me. What the hell's going on up here? I leveled up by leaving the dungeon? Okay, good for, good for me, I guess. No, let's continue our exploration. By going down. By going down. Hmm. Interesting. Mall wood. Like a woods? Is 
this is where all the cool guys are hanging out? Usually I don't see so many, like, real players going around doing stuff. Malwood. I feel like we've done this with another character, though. Catwoman. Oh, look, it's a bunny, guys! Look, a little bunny! That's adorable. The real Batwoman is uh, Halle Berry. Oh, it was, is it Halle? Who? <laughs> yeah, what, what was uh, is, Isn't it Halle Berry? It was, it was Catwoman in the, the 2000s one or whatever. That's the true Catwoman. Cinematography at its finest in, in that film. Slay the bandit centuries? Whatever that is. Let's go kill it. Hmm. Little bunny just living his life out here in the dark woods. Well, actually, they're they're pretty pretty lit up these woods. Yeah, this is actually pretty light in here. Travel to the skeletal rise? Fence says the math doesn't matter. Whatever that is. Says she saw you. Should we put this girl out of her misery? No, no, she's dead anyways. I know you'll make it right. And I know you'll come down. I picked up a bandit note? From who? Ooh, sorry. Activate the lava. Hmm. Destroy the skeletal constructs. Really? Again, we're doing the skeletal constructs thing? Destroyed one skeletal construct? I'd say you destroyed all skeletal constructs. Hey, look, there's another bunny! Just hopping along. Wait, your weapons shoot like artillery strikes? That's crazy. That is a really cool divine ability, I love it. I need more time. Oh, there goes that ability. It was a lot of fun though. It was fun while it lasted. Maldux's Death Trap Resplendent Guardian? That's a mouthful. Shrine. All hits are cool. Was I stuck on like some kind of weird bush thing there? 
It's a bit odd. Hmm. I mean, like, it's a good ability, but it's not like the Divine Artillery Strike. Maldwood's done? We already mauled Maldwood? I was kind of expecting some kind of big boss to fight, but alrighty. Oh, I actually got a better tunic. Mind blown. Out of the dungeon we go to faster tides, higher lands. To explore where other people have already explored. I'm assuming this area, yeah, level 36, that area is going to be locked. Hmm. Another real player, eh? Another real player. Have I tried Redfall? I have not tried Redfall yet. Lights watch. Yeah, they, they, sadly, they didn't invite me to any sort of early Redfall playing. It's heartbreaking. But it's how she goes. Sometimes that's just how the cookie crumbles. Enter the Radiant Cemetery. Or we could do the dungeon. Assuming there's, like, a big event down here. Is this, like, a stronghold in that area, or...? Hmm. Lights watch. Alright, let's do lights watch. Let's get it done. I don't know, I, I usually get pretty early access to Xbox stuff, so... I don't know, let's see how it goes. Like I said though, some Bethesda stuff is like... a little bit weird. In regards to how it's like handled PR wise. Was that thumb guy the guy you guys timed out that never came back? Because he commented on a bunch of videos saying how much he liked it. Was that before he got kicked and killed by. Who was that? Bateman? Did you kill him? Did you break his spirit? Some journalists. Yeah, well. I don't think they had early access. They were, uh, they were brought in to. Uh, like a, a press event. They were, they were brought in to go and do that. From what I understand, I don't know if they, or do they have like a code or code of it, or do they have like a, a demo? Because what I understood was that some PR or journalists and some content creators were brought in to go and like play it somewhere and do stuff. Not that they had it like available to them at home, if that makes sense. There you go. I need more time. I need a key to open this door. Left or right? <sighs> Slay the Watchman. How the Watchman will be. You know what a Watchman looks like. Oh, here we go. Test the time about. That's funny. You guys don't have the ultimate authority like the labels. Besides, I really time people out. Only when I feel like I have to step in.
I was a creepy watchman, where would I be watching from? That's a good question. A protection shrine? Nobody wants those. Unless you're playing on an extremely high difficulty. Much rather have the like, just like, attacking abilities and stuff. Why was he doing like a bowing at that guy instead of killing him? Thank you for your key. Now we can go open that area, eh? Should be fun. Hmm. It was a trap! It always is. Egg hammer. Never as good as that world boss stuff, eh? I need time Never quite as good. It. Travel to Light's War Room? Destroy the construct. Okay. Pretty creepy ass looking place, but I like it. The best class so far? I think the Necromancer is the most powerful. Hmm. Yeah, by uh, quite a bit. I would say the Necromancer class is like very OP. I, I like all of the other classes in this game, but like this one. Uh, it's a lot more work for something that just doesn't do much, if that makes sense. But you guys can do a lot. With your likes on the stream, what? Yeah, subscribing is great. Donations cool. Consider becoming a channel member. Cool perks, cool boats, cool icons beside your name. Feel better than other people. There's the patron option, the Discord for stream alerts, the Xbox Store affiliate link, the Amazon Store affiliate link as well. Really, a chest onslaught? Of course. How do I get what's in the chest? Did that say fur lined mittens? And it's all stuff that absolutely sucks in comparison to what I already had. Rough. I'm kicking ass with the druid. 
it was a uh, pretty weak class for a long time, and it takes forever to do. Like, if you get to, like, a level 20 with all the other classes, they just absolutely, like, eviscerate the environment. Whereas the Druid is still very slow hits. So, like, you could be doing faster damage with the Necromancer, and you would have a gang of skeletons doing a lot of your leg work. If you went with that class. Because these wolves honestly don't do a whole lot. They're there, but they don't do a whole lot. this whole time. A winter hunter? What is it, like, hunt for winter? It's a weird titling to have. Very weird titling to have. My bags are full. There are fur line myths. Is that it? Did I did I finish the dungeon or was that dungeon complete or did I miss that? The loot store? What loot store? Cathedral quest or crest? That's even worse than what I have. Huh. Well, that would be more interesting. Oh, like a microtransaction store that you're asking, or what? Alright, let's, let's see what the hell this is. This is like some kind of... Why am I walking so slow? Cemetery. Hmm. A level 8 is over here? Interesting. I can't believe it's almost time to actually call it an end to the, the beta. It's been such a time. You know what I mean? Because we've, like, the, the days are almost done, I've done all the classes.
is too great. Your burden is too great? Who says that? My burden is too great. Look at this guy. It's, 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 it's too much of a burden. It's too great. I am kind of curious what's down there. Yeah. Hmm. Real money. It's all about cool money. Question is, why haven't you grabbed a sky pass yet? <laughs> that actually would be a very interesting YouTube thing that they could integrate, where it's like you could unlock things to use on the channel by spending X amount of hours or time or something or in their comments or something and like going through like a battle pass. We've talked about this on YouTube before. But I thought that would be hilarious if that was a thing in this. Is this a town right here? Oh, Margrave. Margrave? I was kind of hoping this would be like a big dungeon -y area. What is this? <laughs> huh. I've got furs, skins, and steel. Yeah, whatever, bro. Good deal. Father voice. Stay on your guard. Alright, uh, let's go see this other area. See what that's all about. Yeah, we do have a lot of emotes. I, sadly, I don't think we'll ever unlock a new one, though, but... Yeah, we, we, we missed the window for that one very narrowly. I feel like if we would have pushed, we could have had that one, but yeah, that's, that's not happening again, I don't think. But then again, I never thought we'd unlock a new emote, and through Filet, we ended up unlocking... How many did we unlock? Three there in a row or something like that? I mean, I did put money into it too, but... Yeah, that was... Uh... And yeah, that was basically all Filet's effort on that one. I didn't think that was going to happen, so you never know when weird things are going to go on. The Disturbed Grave. Hello there. Besides, we got a ton of emotes, so we're, we're pretty good to go, I think. They're all fun, weird, quirky. Cool, so does that mean we're kind of done? Is there something down here? Let's try to make sure we're getting all the spots. If Xbox buys Square, is Xbox a monopoly in MMOs? I mean, I don't think there's really a such thing as a monopoly in MMOs. Um, I, I don't believe you would be able to define from a legal standpoint having a monopoly in genres. Like, it would be as if, if, if Disney bought, you know, another company, you know, would they have a monopoly in the action film genre? That's not really a thing, if that makes sense. It would be like, it might be a case for something that they would have to furtherly investigate if, you know, that kind of thing was going on, but it wouldn't be like, you know, they, they wouldn't be like, oh, you got a monopoly in the, in this genre, that's just not really something they define. Yeah. I want to explore the bitter road, guys. Yeah, okay, so we... I, I think we've really actually done absolutely everything. So that's pretty good. The Kaiba chat. Anyways, uh, I think that's good for now, guys. Hope you had fun. Hope the beta was action-packed. 
I have to sit here and ponder if I want to do a final review thing for the beta, if I should just leave my one review as the fine review as I what I have, you know, the one I did earlier, or if I should do like an altogether review, but yeah, anyways, it was, it was fun, hope everybody had a good time, and uh, we killed some things, our Diablo.